Hey guys, it's Katie from Crazy Maisie Creations. How are you? Come on in. Just fixing the camera. Let's pull up the live. It is a Saturday night. What's up? What's up? What's up? All right. I have to go to my page, which I'm hardly ever on anymore. And I'm so sorry about that, guys. Um... I feel like if I go live, it's for the Crafting Coaches Corner. And throughout the week, I'm so tired. Um, usually, I'm in bed by now. <laughs> but I wanted to go live and um, hang out with you guys. So um, I didn't know Teeny was going live when she did. But it was okay. It gave me time to cut some items. There's my Teeny girl. Hey, Michelle. Hey, Mom. Hey, Terry. Hey, Cynthia, come on in, guys. Uh, spread the love. You know what to do. That's not what I want to do. Where am I? Who am I? <laughs> the thing. Wait, wait. Oh, shoot. Wait. Oh, come on. Facebook is so wacky. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's see. Let's open it. And now let's share it. Hey, Cindy. All right, you guys, spread the love. I'm doing it right now um, because you never know what I'm going to be doing in my life and who I'm giving surprises to. You never, never know. So Okay, I think I got them all. I hope I got them all. Hey, Lois. Hey, Jasers. Hey, Susan, my clubbies are your hey, Susan. Clubbies, I miss you. I miss you guys so much. Hey, Lila. Oh, they're all here supporting. Hey, Jessica. Oh, I love my clubbies. I miss you guys. Hey, Carla. Hey, Julianne. All right. So um, we are streaming on YouTube and we are streaming on Facebook. So let me pull up the YouTubers and see what's happening there. Because we got to be fair, right? I love my YouTube family as well. Hey, Amy, how are you from West Virginia? Oh, my God, you say I look great? That's what 23 pounds off does. But I still got a long way to go, girl. But 23 pounds, I'm down. I'm super excited. You know, it really helps doing it with friends. Can you guys see me? Yeah, you can. Um, So just on those days or nights that I feel like I want to go raid my freezer and have like a gallon of ice cream, you know, I'll have someone like Michelle screaming, you don't do that. You know, I'm like, you're right, girl. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do it. You know, they bring me back. All right. So hold on. I can fix this. Okay. It's so wonky donkey. All right, guys, you know what we're doing tonight? We're going to play with some pump pumpkins. What I wanted to do tonight, we can't do because I'm still missing, um, I'm missing something that I want to use um, for my big pumpkin. So I have these big pumpkins. I carved them already. But I have to paint this one. So we may paint it. Okay. But um, these are some pumpkins that I've already done. These are now, let me, before I get ahead of myself, the big one that we're doing, I'm going to do with fabric. Um, I don't know why I can't see the live. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. There's Lisa, Lisa. Thank you, Clarinda. Uh, hey, Tracy. Thank you. There's Michelle. Michelle and Rachel. I wouldn't, I'm not going to say Teeny or Jace because they're the ones that eat everything in front of us. I would say Toboggan, Michelle, and Rachel. Those are the ones that when I go to them and I'm like, oh my God, I want, I want bread. They're like, girl, don't do it. Don't do it. But like Fridays, yesterday was my cheat day. So yesterday I had a little bit of uh, Froyo, frozen yogurt. Uh, just, you know, the kind that you buy by the pound, like you, you do it yourself and you put the toppings on it and they weigh it and you pay by the pound or whatever, by the weight. Um, but I told Doodles, I was like, I just want you to go pull it and put it back, right back. I don't want a lot. You know what I mean? So that's all I had. And uh, that was my cheat. So it was good. I'm glad I had it. Um, but, uh, I know Jason's eats bread, like Michelle's and I think, 
I think Rachel's also downfall is uh, Diet uh, Dr. Pepper. And he like will open a Diet Dr. Pepper in front of them. I'm like, how rude, Jacers. Meanwhile, Jace is walking around like, look at my big old belly. Look at my big old belly. Look at my big old belly. Like, like he has a pumpkin inside him. He's like, look at my big old belly. Look at my big old belly. And we're like, join the challenge with us. And he's like, uh, no, I'm going to go eat, a, I don't know, a burrito or something. You know, um, I was just looking at myself going, look at my big old Bella. That's Jace. Look at my big old Bella. <laughs> Makes me laugh. I love you, Jacers. I love, I love Jace. Listen, if you can't make fun, fun of your family, who can you make fun of? Listen, make fun of me all day long. All right. So I got lots of pumpkins on my table. So anyway, this big guy, I have two of them. Um, I don't know. I know what, how I'm going to, what I'm going to do. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or sell it. Okay. That's number one. Um, my idea is I went to Hoblobs and I bought fabric. Okay. And I'll show you all the fabric I bought. This is the one. Look at this pattern. Look at that. Is that not pretty black and white? And I'm thinking of doing it with like this velvet purple. Is that not fabulous? Can you see that? I don't know if it comes across, uh, in the camera, but like in person, it's going to be fabulous. It's going to be fabulous. So that's what I'm thinking for this pumpkin. But let me show you some other fabrics that I bought. And uh, I'll do this on a live, maybe during the week. I don't know. I'm still waiting for, I bought upholstery tacks, um, like really, really pretty ones. And they haven't come yet. And I got an email that it was on back order, but I thought the back order was, um, was done. I guess I read the email wrong, you know. Um Okay, so let me show you some other patterns. All right, so look at this fabric with purple, okay? So I got purple and I got black velvet. Those are the two. I wanted to get orange, but they didn't have the... I like the crushed. I don't like the really smooth um, velvet for doing pumpkins. I'm a lover of the crushed velvet. So that's what I look for. Um, but look at this pattern. This... Uh, let me open it up so you can see, like really get a good look at it with the purple. Oh my God. It's going to look so good. Look at it. Oh, you can't see it with the purple. Hold on. I want you to see it with the purple. I need like eight hands. Can, can we make that happen guys? Like can someone give me, look at that with the purple. Can you see that? <gasps> look at it. All the oranges and plums and purples and the mustards. This is so, I saw this fabric and I was like, this is so fall. Such a pretty, pretty fall. Oh my God. I can't wait to do a pumpkin with that fabric. Okay. So I have that one with the purple. Get that over there. I'm trying to, I cut, I already cut, um, fabric for that one pumpkin. All right. And then I have, um, Hey Reba, how are you? Hey Mary. Hey guys. Hey Cynthia. Hey Judy. Hey Evelyn. Kathy Kirkland. Kathy, Kathy Kirkland. Kathy, Kathy Kirkland. Kathy Kirkland, I want to squeeze your face because I talked to Jace today and he told me what you're doing for our event. And I just love you. Just, I could, I could just squeeze the Dickens out of you. Did I just say Dickens? Did you guys see my post where it says, you know, I'm not the type of girl that says gosh darn or whatever. I'm not that girl. Like I'm a cursor. I, I love Jesus, but I cuss. I need Michelle to get me a shirt or, or something that says that. But anyway, um, I just love Kathy Kirkland. Anyway, thank you, girl. Thank you. You're the sweetest. I can't tell you all about it, but just know if you're coming to our event, Kathy Kirkland rocks. Just FYI. All right. Anyway, this is one of the other patterns I'm going to do with the black crushed velvet. I know. I didn't say anything. Connie McCormick, how are you? Now, this is um, a leopard. Now, look at this leopard. This is a napkin this one that i did okay is with napkin but look at fabric look how cute okay so we're gonna do this with the black i think i think we're gonna do that with the black and then i have oh my god you're gonna love kathy kirkland when you meet her you're gonna love her love her hey cindy i love you too kathy kirkland you know that girl um look at the autumn leaves is that not that look at all the colors this is why i love fall you have the umbers, you have the moss greens, the mustards. Oh my God, the browns. Oh my God, against that black. 
love them. I love fall. Not only do I love fall because of the colors, because I'm, I love, um, I'm more, this is my, my earth tones. This is how I dress. I'm more these earth tones, the mustards, the moss greens, the oranges, the burnt oranges, the umbers. This is my palette right here. So I love fall. I love a and, and I don't really love like a tight turtleneck, but I love a turtleneck sweater. I love leggings. I put on my Ugg boots and I'm out the door. And you guys saw this one, right? That's the one I just showed you, which may be one of my favorites. So that's just some of the, the um, fabrics that I bought. So we're going to be making some pumpkins and some other goodies with this fabric. So I wanted to show you that. Oh, let's put this one back. Um, uh, Kathy Kirk. So I was talking to Jace today and I said the first time, um, I met, um, Kathy Kirkland was Lisa Callum introducing me and it was like meeting a rock star. I swear Kathy Kirkland, I had known for about a year in Lisa Callum's private group at the time. And, um, I fell in love with her, absolutely fell in love with her. And I was like, I need to get to know her. And we were at an event together and I went to talk to Kat uh to lisa and sitting right next to lisa was kathy and i was like <gasps> i was like i lost my breath i lost my breath and i was like uh lisa callum before i like knock you over you need to introduce me to your friend over here and it was like meeting a rock star okay so did i did i chit chat enough because i could talk all night guys listen is this thing on can people in the back hear me <laughs> all right let me turn this down just a little bit a little bit more because that's i'm a little person you know what i'm saying i'm a little, little little person i know i love kathy kirkland too hey Jeannie, how are you yes let's get me to a thousand or did you mean a hundred did you mean a hundred or do you mean a thousand because listen i'll take the hundred i'll take the hundred but if we get to a thousand i may faint but i'll give something away that's huge oh you know what i may give no i can't give him away i just got him no, can't do it. Okay. Anywho. Hey, Leanne. Okay. So we may or may not work on this big guy uh, during the week. Okay. So keep your eyes out for him. All right. So we're going to turn. And that's them I got to fix. Um, last fall, Teeny mailed me a whole mess of stems. Um, real stems. And uh, I'm going to be starting to use them. I'm excited about that. All right. So let's get started. I'm going to turn the camera down. Jasers, I just love you. Uh, you're all making me giddy. You're so sweet. We're all sweet. Becky Jones up in the his nick. Hey, Becky. How are you? So last night, uh, yesterday, I was not feeling 100%. I was coming home from the hospital. I think I was talking to Becky, I mean, uh, to um, Michelle and Jasers on the phone. I had a headache. Like, you know, like, not like a pounding, pounding headache, but you know, one of those dull headaches that just lingers and you're just like, oh, this thing would, and every time you turned your head, it just felt heavy, like your head weighed 10 pounds. That's what I had yesterday. And I think it was just, I'm really tired and going to the hospital, going to my, yesterday we went to my dad's in the morning, then went to the hospital in the afternoon. I just think all the running around is just getting to me. So I was really tired. And uh, what is Jason saying, Michelle? What is, I love Jace. He's like, Jay Champagne, oh, you better behave. Oh, what did he say? What if Lisa Callum is telling you to behave, Jasers? Hey Peg, how are you? Oh, you mean a hundred? I thought you meant a hundred. I thought you meant that. Um, so um, I don't know what I was saying about my headache, but anyway, I had a headache and everything. You know, it just seemed like everything was going wrong yesterday. You know, I had a run in with someone I didn't want to talk to, kind of thing. And uh, you know, it is what it is, it's over with. And uh, just made my day even worse but then i talked to my friends and they cheer me up so um last night um last night i missed everything like the lights went out in georgia like if i lived in georgia that's how my night was last night um i ate dinner paid my mother's bills and my head hit that pillow and i was out i wanted to watch lisa kellum last night i wanted to watch rachel boo boo no not rachel boo boo i wanted to watch amanda but I did wake up to go to the bathroom and I did watch Amanda. Did you guys see Amanda? She was our, our um, featured designer last night. It was the first time ever going live. She, I had to watch a replay today in the hospital and she rocked it. Absolutely rocked it. Um, but anyway, um, head hit the pillow and I'm telling you, the lights went out. I was done. Donezo, gonzo, bye-bye. 
And uh, I think I just needed it. You know what I mean? I think. But then I woke up this morning and I was like, oh, in fact, I think it started Thursday because I think Rachel. Oh, no, was it Friday? I don't know. My days are confused because Rachel, I was texting and I was saying I thought it was allergies. That's why I was having the headache. And she said, take a COVID test. And then now that's on my mind. If I have COVID, I won't be able to visit my mom, my dad. My mom's going to be transferred soon, hopefully on Monday. I mean, I got to be there with her to, you know, just to, I put her mind at ease when she sees me, you know. So I was like, I can't have COVID. I just can't have COVID. I was like, all right, I'll take a test when I get home. Thank God it was negative. Thank God. But um, it was on my mind. It was weighing on my mind. Hey, Kathleen. Girl, how are you? My God, I haven't seen you in forever. Forever. Amanda was awesome, right? Okay, what is happening here? He said you talk too much. Who said I talk too much? Who says I talk too much? I don't think I talk too much. The deba- is Toboggan on here? Toboggan, did you guys all see Toboggan's uh, live today? He went live because he was making a sign for Michelle. And it's a really cute sign that says shop. You know, it looks like a stop sign. Really cute for outside their store. And he was showing other signs that they make. <clears throat> and they, I forgot what some of them said. Um, Something street, I don't know. And I was like, where's Wagon Way? He calls me Wagon. Why is there not a street named Wagon Way? That's what I want to know. All right, we're going to get started here. Hey, Bonnie, how are you? Hey, Lila. She did great, right? You would never know it was her first time, right? Tiny. Um, Katie, how is your mom doing? Mom was, uh, she was kind of wackadoodles today. Every day she's kind of wackadoodles. But today she thought um, that the nurse was a klepto. Okay, so she kept like whispering and she was like, keep your pocketbook on your shoulder. And I was like, all right, all right. Um, she also thought that um, she got hit over the head with some, I don't know, just wackadoodle stuff, which is fine. Um, so I'm praying, praying, praying that um, it seems like her medication is working. They got a good combo. Praying it all stays this way for Monday. I Kathleen, how are you, my friends? We live so close near each other and... You know, you'd think we were across the country from each other, right? All right. Let's um let's uh get on with this project or we'll be on all night. But like I never go live on a I look at all these pumpkins. I never go live on a Saturday, right? All right, so this is another pumpkin that I've done. I did this one in napkins as well. It's sunflowers with bees. And then I used trim. This is some really nice trim. I painted the stem. This is one of the stems that um, Teeny gave me. Oh, you guys can't see. One of the stems Teeny gave me, and I painted it gold. Really cute. There's the bottom of them, nice and neat, right? Really, really cute. Michelle, you're supposed to be my friend, not supposed to tell on me. Uh, we're all friends, and that's what Mama Michelle does. She doesn't have favorites. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Vicky. Hey, Sue. Uh, nothing private anymore. Hey, Carol Ward, how are you, my friend? Yo, mama boy. <laughs> oh, you did a birdhouse with napkins. Awesome. So, okay, so I wanted to show you these two, the leopard and the, so we're going to do, we're going to Mod Podge. I have a few different size of napkins here. Um, Let me get this out of my way. Let's put that there, and we'll move the leopard one over here, and we'll put some nice trim on it. I got some really pretty trim for tonight's project, um, but my own mother, not supposed to tell on me. Yes, that's how it goes. Hey, Jeanette, what's going on? You're going to make me get my pump. Yes, get your pumpkins out. Now, I didn't get all the fallout. I just got my pumpkins. I'm Tonight, when I got home from the hospital, I, um, I said, doodles. I said, uh, we need to go to the shed. I mean, we had a sale, so we had to get the swag out that sold. But I wanted to get my pumpkins out. So I have a 12 bins of fall. So I was like, leave all that. Just I want the pumpkins, which is two bins. And I want ribbon, which is four bins. So six out of the 12 bins are pumpkins and ribbon. Not bad, right? Okay, so we have, I wanted to bring three different sizes. So this one is more tall, okay? This one's a little squatty, a little short, little stub, sir. And this one's like the perfect size pumpkin, this green one. Now, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, these are all Walmart pumpkins. This one may be my supplier, but I believe the rest are all Walmart pumpkins. This one may come from my supplier in Jersey. <coughs> hey, Joanne. All right, if we hit 100, I'm going to give something away. All right? I will give some some uh, 
some pretty, pretty things. Hey, Judith Topping, how are you on YouTube? Hey, Patty Crane on YouTube. I'm doing yard work and so are you come on, come on in. Is that what I always say? Come on in. It's like, um, let's do, let's do, we'll do, which one do you want to do? You guys pick which one you want to do. Orange, green, or black. I'm going to let you guys pick it. Give me hearts if you want black. Give me thumbs up if you want orange. Uh, give me, what is there? Give me a smiley face, a laughing face if you want green. Heart for the black, thumbs up for the orange, a laughing face for the green. Hey, Deborah. Oh, I'm excited you're here too. Yeah, Walmart. Um, hey, Katie, I was watching Teeny and I just woke up and now it's your turn. Well, Mary Williams, I'm glad you're here. Okay, we said heart, thumbs up, laughing face. Laughing face is winning. We're doing the green one. Laughing face is the winner. Okay, you guys, you know how I like you to vote on my lives, right? So we have more voting to do. Hey, Wanda. How are you? All right, so we have napkins. Guys, if you don't know, in my Etsy shop, I have napkin bundles, and I just added a few more. Um, I got a lot of these from Teeny. I got a lot of these from Mom. All right. Um, thank you, Bonnie, for sprinkling. Hey, Lorraine. Hey, Kathy. I know, nice materials. You got to work with a nice material. These are some Mackenzie's Child uh, napkins, and I want to use them so badly. Look how cute, but I... Look how cute they are. Look how good they are. This is not Mackenzie's Child. But these, I believe, I got from, I want to say Teeny or Mom. I don't know who sent me the Mackenzie Child. I don't remember. Hey, Christy on YouTube. Hey, Joanna on YouTube. Hey, Gail. How are you? Nice to see you on YouTube. All right. I know, Lorraine, girl. I know you're from New York. All right. Look at this blue. How many of you work with the blue in fall? I love a blue in the fall. Love it. And this happens to be one of my favorite napkins. Okay, so we got some other ones. The black. Look at the black. I'm going to let you guys pick the napkins. I'm addicted to Mackenzie's Child napkins. Uh, so am I, girl. So am I. But I don't want to pay the money. All right. So we have this pumpkin one, which would be cute. Right? Ooh, we could do leopard. Do you want to do a leopard print? That's a different leopard than the other one. Because look at this one. And these are big sellers when you do the leopard. They're big. Um, okay, let's see what else I have. I have this um, bee, which is cute. Because listen, the sunflower bee thing is good for... Um, is good for the fall. Sunflowers and... Just trying to, these are a lot of summer. Let me see what else I have in this bag. I have a whole bin of, who I have smaller Mackenzie's Child. Oh my God, I love it. Love it. Leopard, Susie said leopard. All right. I think leopard too, because they sell big for me in my Etsy shop. We have these pumpkins. Black napkin on green pumpkin. You're not, we're going to paint the green. We're going to paint this white. You're not going to see the green. Okay. We're not going, um, we have this one, which is cute. Um, we have this one. If you see one, love, Judith says the blue. She loves the blue. Oh, look at this one. This is stinking cute. Look at this one with the sunflowers, the birds. That's cute. Um, we have this one. Now, these I got from Mom and Teeny because they're so stinking generous. Okay, so this is like the one that I just used on the big pumpkin that I just showed you. Kenyatta! Hey, girl! Leopard. Pumpkin. Love that sweater one. Which sweater one? Did I miss a sweater one? Um, Lemons. What else we got? All right. That that seems to be what we got for fall. So what do you guys think out of what I showed you? What do you want to do? Do the blue. Kathy's saying blue. Combination would be nice. Um, but yeah, I kind of like this one as well. Um... 
and look at that. That's a little too much for me for this. The pumpkin sweater. This one? Is this the one you're talking about? Lila wants leopard or blue. A lot of leopard or blue. Hey, Jeannie. How are you, girl? All right. So let's see. Black check, Mackenzie Child. I know the Mackenzie Child would look so good on here. But I, 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 I'm not ready to use it. We can mix like something like that would look nice. My comments are not moving. Facebook is for Laura Walsh. Uh, mine is the same way, girl. Or we could stick with this and then bling it out. We could do some blinging coming up. Gary, how are you, my friends? All right, I'm going to let you guys choose. Or do you want to go blue? Or do you want to go blue? All right, give me hearts if you want blue. Give me thumbs up if you want the cheetah leopard thing. Oh, good luck, Jean. Oh, uh, that's awesome. Chrissy on YouTube says blue. Judith says blue on YouTube. Hearts if you want blue. Thumbs up if you want the cheetah. Uh, we're going to do, oh my God, it's like even, but I think, I want to say it's more thumbs up. Hey, Bridget, how are you, friends? I'm believing that you guys want the cheetah. All right, that's what we're doing, cheetah. It's decided. <laughs> and I'm going to do something very soon with my Mackenzie shop. I promise, promise, promise. I have a plan for it, okay? Um, I think I'm going to need another one of these just in case. Let me take it out. Hey, Joyce Lusher. How are you guys? This, what we're doing right now today is a great filler if you're doing a craft fair like jean has a craft fair tomorrow it's not too early to bring your fall stuff like if i was in a craft fair guys i'd be bringing all the holidays no joke i'd be bringing christmas fall easter valentine's i'd be bringing it all and that's what i did when i did craft shows especially these days money's so tight you know what i mean you could be like buy one fall get an easter wreath half price or something like, if you have a large inventory, why not do that? Why not? Why not grab some customers that normally would not be your customer? You know? All right. So, we got our napkins. You guys, I wanted to show you also. Um, Look at these that I got. This tissue paper. Look at bumblebees. Is that not fabulous? And look at this one. Butterflies. Wait, let me turn it around so you guys can see it. Can you see it? butterflies i love it i love looking for napkins and tissue paper you gave me an idea did i did i you taking my idea getting inspired by me are you are you getting inspired all right so we have four napkins you guys whenever you buy a napkin like in my my bundles that i have i give you four nap uh 14 napkins okay most of the bundles so you get two of each napkin okay now, look how big that is. That's fabulous, okay? But what we're going to do is we're going to get, and I don't, oh, we have a, I have one right here. How fabulous. Now, a lot of people use water pens. I don't use water pens. Um, so we're going to do one first. But first, before we get ahead of ourselves, we got to paint this bad boy. And while it dries, we will um, prep our napkins, all right? So I'm going to, this was, how much was this? Five something? Five ninety eight, which is a, and a good price for this pumpkin. Not a bad price at all. Okay, we're going to get some chalk paints. You can use acrylic paint, chalk paint. Honestly, it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, that tissue paper is fabulous. Would you share where you bought? Absolutely. I got it at, uh, that one came from at home, I believe. Let me just double check. Yes, this one came from at home. And look, it was only $2.99. $2.99. You can't beat that. I share all my secrets. All my secrets. Because, listen, there's no shame in my game. All right, let me get, before we start, let's get some paper towel. Because this is a kind of um, an old new mat. <laughs> 
and I don't want to ruin it. So let's try and keep it as good as I can. Um, at least I will give you credit. Yes, Jason. No, Jace, you know how I feel. You go do your thing. Um, wait, before we get started, I got to take this off. I got to take my, my stemmy off. Did I see Rachel Boo Boo on here? Oh, thank you, Kathy. You guys, if you would not mind, spread the love. That would be fabulous. And you know what? This is giving me, I'm going to take my heat gun because it's giving me a little bit of a hard time. And I'm just going to melt that glue that's under there. Um, you guys, if you haven't heard that m myself and my fellow collabs from the uh, Crafting Coaches Corner, we have um, an event coming up in September. It's our first event. We're stinking excited. There are six coaches of all of us in the Crafting Coaches Corner. And we have a guest designer, Iveth Wright. She is going to be guest designing. You guys, we have so many stinking fabulous ideas. And I know you hear all the coaches talking about it. Um, but I'm telling you, it's going to be like nothing you've ever seen. If someone could put the link in, Jace, if you're on here still, if you would put the link in so everyone can go check out um, craftingcoachescorner.com, I would appreciate um, tickets are still available. We don't have many. It's under 10 tickets available. Um, we're going to have, you're going to get the meet and greet. Let me just tell you real quick what you're going to get. You're going to get six coaches. Okay. Each one of us are going to be there live and in person. You're going to get a guest designer, Ivis Wright. You're going to get the meet and greet. Okay. Which is going to be Friday night, which we have so many fabulous surprises in store for you guys. Um, you have um, Saturday and Sunday is the event. Okay. There's going to be three make and takes, uh, breakfast on Saturday and Sunday, lunch on Saturday, swag box, which is, oh my God. Now I was in charge of it. I still am, but Jace knowing how I am, you know, how busy I am with my mom and my dad has really stepped in and really helped a girl out, you know? And that's how I know, like, like we're, we're he's just like my brother, you know? Um, and he's kind of taking the reins and really knocking it out of the park today, helping me out. Um, so the swag box, let me tell you, is going to be fabulous. Um, we're going to have breakout sessions for more personal learning. Uh, we're going to have additional demonstrations by the coaches. Door prizes. Let me tell you about these stinking door prizes. These door prizes are going to be phenomenal. Phenomenal. Okay. I, I can't even, I can't tell you because they're, they're so good. You, you will die. You will stink and die. Um, what else? Uh, you get to shop at General Wholesale. If you guys have never been to General Wholesale, uh, well, get ready. Because it's the size of a football field. And it has everything and anything that you need in the crafting world. You need it. They've got it. And that is the God's honest truth. And if you have never met Sandy and her family um, and the whole team there, General Wholesale, um, go check them out. They do lives during the week. You can see some of their products and what they're all about. They're fabulous. And we're so stinking excited to do our first event at General Wholesale. And the ideas are just every every Sunday we have our meeting. Um, we come up with more ideas. And I always think I turn to doodles and I say, we need more than 24 hours in a day. Like we're never how like how can we do all these ideas? <laughs> you know, it's like someone's got to rein us in. We want to do them all. <laughs> It's so funny. It's so funny. But we just want to make this clear. So we want to knock it out of the park and make it like no other event out there. And so far, the ideas that we're coming up with, trust me, it's like no event out there ever. And you guys know me. I'm a straight shooter. I don't pull punches. If I, if I thought this was going to be some kind of wonky show, I would not, I'd be like, you know what? I got to step away. This is not my kind of thing, you know? But let me tell you, Michelle, Stoney, Teeny, Jace, Rachel, myself, we have idea we've all been to events. We've all been on stage. So we know what we like and what we don't like from going to all these events. You know what I mean? We know what we want to see. We know what we don't want to see. We know what worked, what people, you know, feedback from other people in events, you know, and we're kind of taking our own experience and we're kind of taking what we've seen at other events and we're kind of like melding all that and making it our own. So I'm telling you, like, I'll give you one thing. 
and I think this is public knowledge. I think I've said it before. Um, Toboggan came up with an idea. Like, we're not going to have a stage. Like, there's no one up on a stage. Like, everyone is designing down on the floor. Toboggan had the idea of um, a rolling cart. Let me get a skewer so I can hold my pumpkin. Um, having a rolling table, okay, and us designing on it. And, like, let's say Sally from Memphis says, Katie, how did you put that blah, blah, blah together? I would roll my little table on over to Sally from Memphis, and I'd say, well, Sally, let me show you. And then Sally's going to do it because it's a make and take. So Sally's going to have hands-on experience. She ain't going to have to worry about, oh, my God, what did Katie say? Wait, how did she? And taking pictures of it from, you know, 30 feet away or whatever, nah, or looking at it on a big screen. No, nah. she's going to be hands on. And the other plus is that all anyone who buys a ticket goes into a private group. So in the private group, you guys are chit chatting about travel, about carpooling, about meeting up, all the fun stuff. Right. But the other bonus is that this private group will be available to all the members that bought a ticket forever. So if let's say a year from now, um, Sally from Memphis says, how did Katie do that again? Oh, I wish I could go back. I didn't. I, how? I don't remember. All she has to do is go back to the group, pull up the little slide, you know, from me doing whatever I'm doing. And, uh, you know, she can rewatch it and do whatever the project is. So there's so many great things that are happening. I mean, that's just a little, a little, a uh, little sample, a little sample, a little sample of a little rolling table that goes right up to Sally in Memphis. And Sally in Memphis, she's going to be like, uh toboggan what are you doing so close <laughs> uh michelle i can smell your perfume <laughs> it's gonna be awesome awesome i can't wait did we get to 102 did we get to 100 am i giving things away tonight let me let, me, let someone talk to me talk to me people what are we giving away talk to me i love it i love it Saturday night's the night, guys. I'm going to be giving something away. I think we hit 100. Did we hit 100? Uh, Bonnie, is that not a great idea? That's just one of the great ideas that we have for, for our event. Like, I'm telling you, and I'm not, I'm not blowing sunshine up your bums. I'm not doing it because I'm a straight shooter, and I would tell you, um, no, there's lots of goodies going on. Lots, and listen, how could there not be? Have you met Michelle, Jason, and I, and Teeny, and Rachel, and Toboggan? Uh, are we not fun in a box? I mean, we're a good time. <laughs> Let me tell you, we are a good time. All right. So you don't have to like, when you're covering your pumpkin, you don't have to like do it. You know, you don't have to be so perfect. You know what I mean? It's just a light cover. 101. I saw it with my own eyes. All right. I got to pick a name. Hold on. Hold on. I need styrofoam. Hold on. Let's stick this in here. We're going to let that dry for a second while we pick a couple names. Because I'm going to do a couple giveaways. All right. Well, Kenyatta, you won last week. So I got to keep that there. All right. Let me get a pen. I think I just spit all over myself because I was so stinking excited. All right. I'm going to close my eyes. Um, And we're picking. We are picking. Uh, Wait. Hold on. Stop. 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 Tracy Watson. Tracy Watson. Are you on here? If you're on here. I need you to text me your mailing address because you're going to win a little surprise from Crazy Amazing Creations LLC. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Glenda DeFore. Glenda. Glenda. Glenda White. D-U-F-O-U-R. Glenda DeFore. All right. We're going to pick one more for a surprise. One more. And where it lands, nobody knows. And the winner is June Lind. June Lind. L-Y-N-D. All right, we got three giveaways so far. If we could keep it over 100, guys, we're going to do more giveaways. Three. So you guys, Tracy Watson, Glenda White, the Ford, and June Lind. Text me your shipping address, your mailing address at 845-299-8674. The number is scrolling at the bottom of your screen and uh, I will get them out. I got to get Kenyatta's uh, phone. Look what uh, Kenyatta won last week. She won a phone. Let me show you real fast. 
These are, if you guys don't know Wilds Creek and Company, Toboggan and Michelle, they make my iPads on. I can't take it off, but they make phone holders. Can you see that? I decoupage this one. Make iPad holders. So many wonderful things. I gave a phone holder away from Wilds Creek and Company the other day, and Kenyatta was the big winner. So I got to send that out to Kenyatta this week. Oh, Tracy, congratulations, girl. All right. We are um, going to draw this real fast. What? What is Trace doing? Is that outdoor Mod Podge? I have not used Mod Podge yet. This is truck uh, paint from Waverly Truck Paint. But yes, the Mod Podge that I use, you can put outside. Last year in my private group, I made a pumpkin temporary, and they were all Mod Podge pumpkins. And I um, had it outside my front door, and it stayed perfectly. Yes. Awesome, Tracy. Thank you, girl. Congratulations. You guys, please make sure you have liked and followed my page. If you're on YouTube, please go and uh, subscribe and hit that that bell on YouTube and hang out on YouTube a little while, guys, because YouTube likes it when you hang out for at least 5, 10, 15 minutes, watch a video, you know, let YouTube say, hey, I like this girl, you know, because that's what all the social media wants. All the social media wants is um, for you to just say, hey, I like them. Show me more of them, you know. Draw names for a female, draw names for a male. I will have better chance. <laughs> Gary, you're hilarious. Gary, I, you know I love you, man. You know I love you. Okay, so I'm going to move this over, okay? And we're going to start with the napkins. Okay, I'm just going to let this sit. Hopefully it won't fall. It's going to fall. Hold on. I need I need 1,200 hands. Okay, heat gun is away, and I got to tell you, I love the heat gun. Um, Katie, side note, your Manny looks. Oh my God, it's so bad. I gotta get an an uh, I gotta get a new manicure. It's been like three weeks, and uh, I need a new one. I just haven't had time. Okay, so let's get our. You guys chose. Look at, I already got paint on my thing. All right, you guys chose the leopard. So we're going to do leopard. I got to get tape out here. Tape. Where's my tape? You guys, I use, um, I need water. I'm dying of thirst. Hey, Regina, my fairy godmother's here. Uh, got to order some pumpkins from Walmart. Yes. Gary, friend, I'm sending you a surprise. But Gary, if I send you a surprise, you have to use it on a live. Gary, do you hear me? Gary, if you are my handsome friends. You are getting a surprise from me. You guys, thank you so much for spreading the love and hanging out with me tonight. I am so excited. So excited to be live. Doodles is upstairs uh, hanging out with Clancy and Maisie. And I was like, honey, do you mind if I go live? Usually we watch TV together, you know. Um, the Yankees played this afternoon. I watched that with mom in the hospital. See how easy that is to pull it off with tape? So stinking easy. Um, usually it's three ply, so we're going to check it out and see if there's another ply on here. Hey, Gary, how are you, friends? Haven't seen you in a while. Um, so I watched the Yankee game with my mom in the hospital today. And um, so there's no game tonight. And Doodles was a little tired because he did a lot of work uh, this weekend for uh, the business. And I said, you know what? Go relax. You deserve it. And... Um, We've been doing really well on our diet, and uh, he just wanted to go up, take a hot shower, and lay down. Okay, so like I said, these are usually three-ply. Hey, Debbie, how are you? You love the butterflies? I love that butterfly tissue paper as well. For $2.99, you can't beat that. All right, so we pull that apart. Now... You can order yourself um, a water pen from Amazon. I think they cost like $6.99, $7.99. But I don't know why you would, okay, when you can take your paintbrush, okay, just take any paintbrush at all, okay. And I don't like um, putting straight edges anywhere 
Like if you notice these, these are all ripped up. They're all, but you can't see it. It all like blends together, but it's all ripped up pieces. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. Okay. I'm just going to wet my, my brush in my little water thing. And I'm just going to wet my napkin. Okay. And you can, like I said, you can get one of them um, water pens. Absolutely. But I mean, water is free at my house. Well, I do pay for water, but I mean, it's free. And uh, a paintbrush. I have paintbrushes. So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to rip them apart. And it gives it like a little frayed edge. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. And it's really a better look than one of those straight edge. You know, you'll see people modge podge and they're putting like a straight. It's almost like you guys heat press, you like making t-shirts. You never want to heat press your shirt and have that straight line. You always want to cut around your design, you know, when you're heat pressing um, a t-shirt or something. So it's kind of the same concept, you know. Hey, Deborah, how are you guys? Thank you so much for coming in and hanging out. I got to make this more of a habit. You know what I mean? But with mom being in the hospital and life being so dung and crazy, um, usually at this time, I'm exhausted. So, but I wanted to go live. All right. So we're going to cut this down, even not cut it, but we're going to rip it apart even more. But I'm going to put that to the side and we're going to do the other squares. And I kind of like move my brush in like a winding, you know, so it's not like straight. Can you guys see what I'm doing? And just be careful that you don't wet your whole table because you don't want the whole napkin to get wet. I have a slight little wet spot on my... On my table here. Woo, Lordy. Lordy, Lordy, Lordy. All right, so that's two. Who are you yelling at, Jace? I have to keep an eye on that Jacers, you know what I mean? So, guys, what are we doing for the weekend? Any big plans? I mean, I know last weekend was the big weekend, Memorial Weekend. Are we all recovering from a big weekend last weekend? I didn't really do anything for Memorial Weekend with Mom being in the hospital. Tomorrow, Mom will be in the hospital five weeks. I can't get over that my mom has been in the hospital five freaking weeks. Like, it just bugs me out that I've been alone in this house. Well, I'm not alone. I have doodles in my, and Clancy and Maisie. But without my mom, I feel alone. Um, but for five weeks, oh, I just can't. Now, how many of you have one of those water pens? And you're like, why did I spend money on a water pen? I mean, I know they're only $7 or $8. I know they're not like, you know, it won't break the bank on you. But why spend money on something when... You can just use what you already have. All right, there we go. I worked 10 hours yesterday, had today off, and have to work tomorrow. Oh, Tracy, well, I'm glad you want a little something-something, girl. Okay, we're going to do this next one as well. I'm so sorry, Carrie. Prayers for your mom. Thank you. I appreciate that. Seems to be that um, they got a good cocktail now. I mean, this whole time... They, I mean, if you guys know anything about dementia or anything with the brain, it takes time to figure out, um, you know, I call it a cocktail. It's really, you know, combinations of medicines, you know, um, but they had to find a good cocktail that would work in my mom's brain and her body and her chemistry. And I think they finally did it. I think they finally did it. Hey, Heather. Why are you going out, coming back in? What's going on, girl? Are we going to hit 100 again so I can give more stuff away? Huh? I got things I can give away. I got, I got things. I got giveaways. You guys spread the love, like, and follow my page. This one's giving me a hard time. I don't know why. 
Why are you giving me a hard time? Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. It's Connie McCormick on here. She leave me already. I got to keep an eye on that Connie McCormick because she comes on and she leaves. There, I got it. I don't think you saw me. Heather, I saw you, girl. How are you? Uh, this is going to be cute when it's done. Yes, and we're going to put some bling on this one. This one's going to get some bling, bling, bling. Bling, bling, bling. You guys, uh, don't forget, in the bottom of my comments... You will see a green little heart with a, I call it a baseball diamond around it. That's my subscriber group. Um, That is my happy hour, Katie's happy hour. And I'm going to start going, I, I was supposed to start going live in there in May, but with life being crazy like it has been, um, hopefully mom will get into rehab on Monday. And, oh, and not just that, FYI, off, off the topic of my subscriber group for one second, I got calls for jury duty. What? This is not the time that I got to be called for jury duty. You know what I'm saying? Like, could we make it a time where I have less time to, you know? I was like, no, 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 no. So I had a call yesterday to see if I had a report on Monday. Thank goodness they didn't call my number. So I don't have to report on Monday. That's a plus. Anyway, my subscriber group, Katie's Happy Hour. It's $4.99 a month. And I'm going to start going in there. Hopefully, mom will be settled on monday and i'm going to start going in there this week and we're going to do cute little projects i'm going to have um bow tutorials in there um for 4.99 guys it's a steal so if you want to check it out and join um katie's happy hour for 4.99 a month hit that green button you'll see a heart next to your name so whoever is in my uh subscriber group my supporter group whatever facebook wants to call it um they uh you'll see that green heart next to your name whenever i go live and that's how you know who's in my um my group i think they always have bad timing for i know all well, right when i saw that come in i was like no 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 and i forgot about it because i was going to get a doctor's note saying you know i'm a caretaker for my mom and she's in the hospital blah 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 you know but totally forgot about it randomly and then the other day, Doodle said to me, uh, did you ever take care of that jury duty? And I was like, no, uh, now I'm stuck. But the way I look at it, maybe it was a sign from God just to get it over with, or maybe they'll never even call me. Who knows, right? Who knows? Have your PC give a letter to excuse medical reason? Yes, I know. I mean, I could get out because of my, um, my MS. Um, but I don't want to, I don't want to do that. You know, I gotta, we all gotta do our thing, you know, and you know, I just pray that I don't get called, right? And then hopefully I don't get called and they leave me alone for, what is it, seven years, 10 years, whatever. Do you know this? I've been with Doodles for uh, 20 years. We've been together and he has never once, I don't believe, now that I say that out loud, I might be wrong, but I don't believe he's ever once got called for jury duty. I've been called one other time. Um... Thank goodness I don't get called anymore, Judy. I'm too old. Oh, you're lucky. Um, we have two kitchens and dining room, and I work both of them. Yesterday, I served lunch, one dining room, dinner, and the other. I worked 8 a.m. Oh, God bless you, girl. God bless you. All right, so we're just going to finish. Is Teeny still in here? So I guess Connie McCormick. Oh, there's Connie McCormick. Connie McCormick, you're not so lively on my lives anymore. What's up with you? I got to discipline Connie McCormick. Are you guys here for it? Are we not going to give more stuff away? Why? What happened to the hundred? Make me cry. You don't want to make me cry, do you? All right, let's get to Maj Podging. Maj Podging. I'm just going to hit this one more time with the heat gun. And then we're going to get our, our game going. Oh, my God, Gary, seven times, serve four? Lord have mercy. Teeny, why are you so quiet? Why are you all so quiet? You got called, Connie? Lord, never seen this done. How big are those squares? And where did you get the materials? All right, the pumpkin, I believe, came from Walmart last year. Uh, the paint, Walmart, I used 
uh, Waverly chalk paint in white, and the top is not on. Um, what else do you need to know? The napkins. These napkins I got from a friend, from mom, who's on here. Um, but I get most of my napkins from either Marshalls, uh, TJ Maxx, at home, Home Goods, wherever I can find them. Oh, you're cleaning up? Okay. All right. Teeny's cleaning up. All right. So they put my skewer away. All right. So we're not going to keep, I need a sip of water. I talk so much. Is Jace on here? Okay. Um, you keep missing my comments, girl. No, I don't. Don't even. All right. So here are our leopard and we're going to, there's going to be no rhyme, no reason where we put them. Um, Maji Paji Pudding Pie. There's my Maji Paji Pudding Pie. Where's my other Maji Paji? Oh, there it is. Hold on, let me find my other Maji Paji. Maji Paji Pudding Pie. Ooh, my arm. I think I have like a tennis elbow. So I buy Maji Paji Matte. Do you guys know that they sell it? I'm going to get it this week. Maji Paji in glitter. Have you guys seen that? And the glitterness of it all? So, yes, Maj Podge came out with, like, a glitter Maj Podge. What? It's crazy. Um, So, let me move that. Let's get this. Ooh. Let's get a brush for Maj Podge Pudding Pie. Hey, Carolyn, how are you? Tell her, guys. Tell her. Tell me what? Girl, you know. You know you don't stay on my lives. Don't make me. All right, let's get. I want. I like using an older brush. I like using an old brush. Like that's an old brush. You see it? Like teeny be like, girl, throw that out. And I'm like, no, I use it for my Maji Paji. Okay, I use it for my Maji Paji put in pie. There we go. All right, so you guys can see. I didn't have my camera good. Am I straight? Why do I feel like I'm not straight? There we go. Sorry for the little. I want you guys to see. All right. So what we're going to do here is we're going to cut these in pieces. I'm going to take my little water bath. Okay. And I'm just going to make little sections and I'm going to just make them about this size. I can make them bigger. I can make them smaller. Um, it's easy to work with smaller um, sections. Okay. And you're going to see at the end of all this, it will all blend together. Okay. The, the hardest part, well, not hardest, but it's the most tedious part of this is, you know, ripping your napkins. That's, you know, it's time consuming sitting here and you want to do different shapes. You don't want to have any straight edges, you know? All right. I think we're good there. Uh, Damon showed us that the other day. Damon showed you what the other day? We don't have a Marshall's home goods or at home. Mom, you don't. I'm going to have to send you. What do you need me to send you, girl? I'll send you whatever you need. All right. So we're going to take our Mod Podge. I'm just going to stick it in. And we're going to do different uh, little sections at a time, okay? So let's move all my napkin pieces. He showed you Mod Podging on a pumpkin, Damon. When did he start DIYing? When, what, what's going on, my friend? So all I'm doing is different sections, okay? Then I'm going to take a piece of my napkin. Okay. And all you're going to do, like I take the back of my, to get in the grooves, you want to get in those grooves. Okay. And then I just take lightly going over the top with some more Mod Podge, sticking it down. And this Mod Podge is going to dry clear. So you don't have to worry about um, you know, seeing the Maji Podgy. I feel like I could do this all night. Like I am here for it. I have not 
crafted in so long. You guys, we could do an all-nighter. Who would want an all-nighter? Oh, Lord. Doodle's probably like, is she ever coming up to bed? We could just continue an all-nighter and just give things away. Like, I'm here for it. Okay, so we're going to take another piece. And I'm not going to, like, I want them to maybe overlap in some areas, you know. I'm going to take the back of our brush and just go down the groove. Go down the groove. You don't want it to wrinkle. So you want to be nice and gentle with it, okay? Just like that. Down the groove. And you don't want to put too much Mod Podge on your brush, okay? Because you will rip your, your napkin. You want just light coats, okay? Just nice, light coats. Okay, can you see that? Um, you gotta love, Gary, you gotta love it. Hey, Teresa, anything you know, I love napkins of any kind. Mom, you got it, girl. Let me write myself a note, Mom. Because you know, Mom, if I don't write a note, Mom, send me your address. I think I have it, but I'm gonna um, send it to me again. I mean, I should have it after the sign bundle escapade, right? All right. So I'm going to start with the top of the pumpkin. We're just going to go around the top. Top. I don't have much Mod Podge in this um, container. And we're just going to... And it's okay to overlap. It's all good. Okay, and if you miss any areas, you can we can always come back later on. You know, it's kind of like doing an arrangement. If you want to do a filler, we can come back and do a filler spot, you know. So I'm putting them in all different directions. So you see there's a little spot right there that I didn't cover. But that's okay. We can come back and we'll cover it. Now, guys, these pumpkins that we make, either Mod Podge or the fabric ones I'll do during the week, they can, um, I mean, go on Etsy. See how much people are charging for them. I mean, they can bring you anywhere from... 25 35 45 dollars depending on how you um um what you put on it after the napkin or the fabric you know meaning the bling and everything that goes on it um some i mean some of these pumpkins are pricey you know so do not count out um a fabric pumpkin or a decoupage pumpkin um, to use as filler in your craft shows or in your Etsy shop if you need, you know, because you have to have different price points in your Etsy. Now, I'm not a business coach, but I'm just talking from experience. Um, you want different price points, you know, and honestly, uh, something like this in the fall, even in the summer. I mean, when do you start seeing pumpkins? I mean, do they start playing? When do, when do you plant a pumpkin? I don't know too much about planting pumpkins. But for some reason, like, I feel like corn and pumpkins kind of go together, you know. But, I mean, I wouldn't be afraid to put a pumpkin in, you know, one of my designs for the summer with some flowers and some raffia. I'm here for it. Um, Katie, thin out your Mod Podge with Axe. Little water? Why? Why do you want me to thin it out? It's thin. Girl, what are you talking about? I got... Why am I going to thin it out? Why do you want me... Tina, you kill me when I'm live. You know that, right? You kill me, girl. We used to take pictures and burn around the edge of it, then Mod Podge to a board for it hanging. Oh, you did the burn method? I love the burn method. Love the burn method. I learned that, was it last year or the year before? 
And I use it a lot, actually, the burn method. So Teeny wants me to thin out. I don't know why she wants me to. It's too thick. I see it. It's not too thick, girl. What are you saying? It's too thick. It's perfect. My Mod Podge is perfect. Girl. Get glasses, Alice. Get glasses. <laughs> hey, teeny. Get glasses, Alice. Get glasses. Do you guys remember that commercial or my show and my age? Hmm? All right. Now, so we have that. We're going to take another napkin. Um, we did it years ago. Many. I know. Listen, Teeny always says it, and I so agree with her. Listen, people, anything when it comes to arts and crafts has been done millions of years ago. We're not inventing the wheel. You know what I'm saying? Like, people act like, oh, I'm the one who invented this. Like, someone actually did a live and gave credit to someone for putting fabric on a pumpkin. I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, I when I was a kid, I used to see it in in um in Nordstroms and and um Fortune Offs. Like, we used to go to Fortune Offs for my mom used to shop there for um you know for holiday stuff, and w there were fabric pumpkins back then, and I was a kid, and she's giving credit to someone, and I'm like, what? And Teeny's like always saying like it's been done before. We're just putting our spin on it, you know? And I always say, we're not inventing the wheel, people. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's a craft. Whether it's wreath making or it's, you know, mod podging a pumpkin or painting a picture or a so whatever it is, you know, it's it's been done before. You know, it's been done before. I so agree. Um, Hey, Lori. Sorry, but I have no way of doing that. Did enjoy it, though. Katie, who is the queen of Maj Podge? Girl, you're the queen of DIY. Don't don't limit yourself to Maj Podge. <laughs> you are the queen of DIY. Okay. I said to my doodles before, I said, he said, I'm going to go up and take a shower. And um, I said, oh, so you're not going to read comments for me? And he just looked at me like, he's like, why are you asking me that now? I feel guilty because that's the wife's duty is to make you feel guilty, right? Isn't that my job as a wife? Make you feel guilty? I'm like, everyone loves you when you come on. Is the pumpkin foam? Yes, Carol, it's a styrofoam pumpkin. Yep, yep, yep. It sure is. It's a styrofoam pumpkin. And I just used the back of my brush just to get in the little crevices. That's a great job. Now, we've only used um, one square so far. Well, we're on our second square, actually. Um, of this napkin. But I'm just taking my time. We're chit-chatting tomorrow. I can't watch the end game with my mom because it won't be on the television in the hospital. Um, it's on the Peacock, Peacock channel. We have that here, um, but they won't have it at the hospital. So um, I will probably bring my laptop to the hospital to do some work while I'm there. Yeah, how about that DIY I made tonight? That was cute. That was cute, but I think I've seen that before, girl. I have seen it before. Actually, um can't remember who I saw do it, but I liked how you put your little spin on it. I love the little bling bling you did and the little butterfly. It was very, very cute. 
Very cute, girl. Very cute. I'm excited to um, do some fabric pumpkins next week. Um, they're always fun to do. So do you see how like going over um, these pumpkins, like they blend in, like you don't even know that I cut these. That's what's great about not having such a straight edge. You know, I hear doodles upstairs in the kitchen. Hey, Laura on YouTube. How are you? Thanks for coming on, girl. I appreciate you. Um, Katie, how is your mom? Sorry if you said. Oh, it's okay. Uh, it seems like mom is doing okay. Hopefully Monday she'll be going to rehab. Um, I think they finally got a good um, combination of um, her medication. So it's been about like Wednesday would be a week that there has been no incidents. Um, she's still you know, not talking herself, you know, like today she, I, I was saying earlier, um, she was telling me that the, the nurse is a klepto. She's like, watch your back, you know, and everything is so secretive, like when she's talking. So I know this is not my, my mom. My mom would never, ever talk like this ever in a million years. But, um, she was saying the nurse is a klepto. So watch my pocketbook when I was there. Okay, so we're going to cut another one. I'm not cut. We're going to use um, our paintbrush. Um, yeah, and then she was saying something about um, she was shoved into a fight or something, got hit over the head. I don't really remember. Um, so I just went with it, you know, and, um, you know, played along with it. But she just, you know, she talks wacky. She thought we were watching the Yankee game, and she's like, what time is this movie over? I was like, Mom, it's not a movie. It's a Yankee game. Now, my mom, like, I grew up with, with sports. You know, she knows the Yankee game, you know? And she's like, yeah, no, what, what time is the movie over? And she wanted to know how uh, the movie started. Um, like, who, where did, where did it begin? Was it a book? You know, and I was like, okay. You know, so she's just, her mind is just um, not with us at this moment, you know? So, but that's okay. I'm still with my mom. So we just take it one day at a time. She'll go to rehab. I don't know for how long. And um, hopefully, you know, she'll do a little better every day in rehab. That's what I'm praying for. And in the interim, I'm going to be here. Crafting with you guys, visiting my dad, you know, and thank goodness my dad doesn't really understand too much about what's going on. So that, that much I'm thankful for, you know, for that I'm thankful for. Thank you, Patty Crane. I appreciate that. Hey, Pam James, what's going on, girl? Pam James, did you get back to me? I know I asked you about your event. Um, I want to send you something for it. But I just don't know if it's just a fake bake kind of thing or so if you could text me and let me know, I would appreciate it, friends. Hey, Giselle, how are you, girl? I'm excited to decorate this bad girl. This cutie patootie, I'm ready to put some bling bling on her once we get it all maji podgy put and pod down. Um, 
Um, oh, thank you, Donna. I appreciate that. Your mom and dad are in my daily prayers as I, oh, Jean, girl, thank you. How are you doing, friends? How are you doing? I know you say you have a craft show tomorrow. I pray that you do well, and I'm sure you will. It's a hard time now, honestly, for craft shows, the way the economy is and gas. Um, I know that my um, county here, they have a big one. Uh, it's called the Nyack Street Fair. It's really big. It's going on since I was a kid. And um, they actually had to um, um, stop because the crowds just weren't coming. You know, they're saying people are going out, yes, but not spending the money. You know, people are not spending money like they were. Um, I think the economy might have them a bit scared, but listen, eventually it will all work itself out. Eventually. Um, is that styrofoam? Yes, just how it's styrofoam. Yeah, very difficult, right? My family just came in from my great nephew's. Oh, that's awesome. That's fabulous. Um, I can tell my Etsy shop has slowed down. Today I had a big sale. But um, I can see a difference, honestly, in my Etsy shop. Um, it's just, I don't know if it's, it's the time of year, yes. You know, because people are getting ready for summer and saving for summer. But I also think, you know, it's the economy as well. I sold three today at our market. Now, Heather, is that good? I mean, three, that's it? I mean, if I go to, a, a, to an event, you know... I mean, I, I, I want to sell literally about 40 wreaths, you know, 40. I mean, that would be my low number to sell. So I don't know. Is that like a good number? I mean, were you there all day? I don't know anything about the event. Only four hours. Okay. So you sold, ah, oh, what happened here? I got a little bit of Mod Podge on my finger. So you had a setup and everything? I don't know. See, like the setup, that's what kills me. Going to an event and having to set everything up. And first of all, we rent a truck, okay? We rent a truck, load up the truck, prep the night before. You know, you're prepping for these things. It just doesn't happen, you know? Um... And you got to load up the truck, got to unload the truck, you got to set up the tents and, you know, everything, your tables, everything, you got to set up your register area, your cash register, all that stuff. I mean, it is a lot of freaking work. That's why I don't do them anymore. I refuse to do them anymore, you know. Um, I would do a live sale before I did another craft show. And honestly, I haven't done a real craft show in a few years. Uh, before the pandemic, I would only do jury shows because that's really the only place where you really make decent money, you know. Um, can you do a whole square instead of piecing it? Anybody? You could, absolutely, but I don't want to get wrinkles. You know, I want as little wrinkles as possible. So I choose to um, to separate it, but you could. Um, yes, there is a chance you will have wrinkles. Yeah, that's what I said. Good answer. Good answer, Tracy. So it's better just to break it apart. Take that little extra time. You know, it's like fluffing a wreath, you know, or fluffing a bow. Take a couple extra minutes and just do it. You know, you don't want wrinkles. You know, I mean, I'm not going to say you don't get any wrinkles, but you get far less wrinkles doing it this way than you would if you did a whole square. Um, I just used my car. It's a monthly market, not a huge event. Oh, okay. So if that's good, go, girl. You go with your bad self. Listen, any sale is a good sale. That's what I say. Any sale is a good sale. Hey, Anne, how are you, friends? I haven't seen you in a while. 
So I guess we're not getting to 100 again. We hit the 100, and then I gave away a few things, and then we won. But that's okay. Maybe we'll get to 100 again. Because, listen, I'm going to, I plan on doing a, uh, this is going to be a nice long live. Why not? I haven't been on in a while. I'm, I'm taking my uh, cue from Teeny. You know, Teeny loves a nice long live. Well, let's do it tonight, guys. Let's do a nice long live tonight. Let's take our time. Let's bring out a pumpkin. Queen Jubilee is on. What's that? Are you talking about the Queen Mother, the English? I love the Royals, but I couldn't watch it. I want the crown to come back on. When is the crown coming back on? I love that movie on Netflix. Love. Love. Who's ready for an all-nighter? Huh? Who is ready? I sold some bows today at our event. Awesome, Wanda. Lots of lookers, but not many buyers. People will tell you the bargains they found. I tell them, good for them. Good for them is right. That's what you say. Because, listen, you are not a bargain. You're not at a flea market, people. You're here to buy good quality products from handmade products one of a kind items and i put a skewer in there because we need to skew this baby down i'm gonna be holding it upside down in a moment cosmo So the only time I, when I'm at a, an event like that, if someone was buying multiples, then I would hook them up with a good price. You know what I mean? But other than that, very, very rare. Unless I felt sorry for someone. You know, um, very rarely did I. Because it's, it's a lot of work to go to these shows. Whether, ooh, excuse me, I had a glug. Or whether big or small, it's still time. And, um you know, away from whatever it is you'd be doing. So you got to, if you want to have a business, you got to run your business like a business, not like a hobby, you know. That's what I say. All right, we're going to start doing Z bottom. Now I cover my whole pumpkin, guys. I cover the whole kit and caboodle. Can you feel, this is not Mind You Lion King, the love tonight, the peace, the evening. Hey, Catherine, how are you? Those guys got to remember, they voted for the largest pumpkin, huh? Yes, it's on TV to celebrate her reign. Elton John is on. Oh, I like Elton John. I mean, I've seen him at The View. So, you know, the view tapes here in New York. So when it first started, um, I don't remember how I got tickets, but I got tickets. I took my mom, my friend, Mary, who you guys know, um, my other friends. Um, and we had a great day in the city. That was a fun, fun day. Um, but Elton John was the guest that day. And um, I think we got a CD that day from him. And we had good seats. We were up close, too. I mean, we could see Elton at the view. Um, but he's not really like one of my, like, I like him. I, I wouldn't turn off the radio if he was on, you know, but if you said to me, um, do you want to go to an Elton John concert? I've been, Would I want to go again. Mm, I don't think so. Okay. Let's do another one. You know, that's how I feel about Elton. Like him. Um, 
Okay, Katie, I'm ready for all the nighters. Made me hot dogs and popped me some popcorn and got go girl. Go. That's what I'm talking about. Now I'm doing a little bit of bigger pieces because I am going to be doing the bottom and I don't need it. Um, I don't need it as, you know, perfect as the top, what you're being, what you're being shown, you know? I gotta tell you, my um, crafting coaches friends, they're quiet. I can't believe I, I haven't gotten one text while live. Crazy. And I just wanna make sure I'm still on camera. So I have a tendency when I work to pull my project off camera. guys thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight i appreciate it and if we get back up to 100 i'm gonna give more stuff away okay more goodies so we've already given away uh four things tonight right And I'm not done. It's been a while since I've been on my page. You guys see me on the Crafting Coaches Corner all the time. When was the last time you saw me on my page? So we need to celebrate. You guys, please do me a favor and like and follow my page. Because as most of you know, I was hacked. The hacksation is real. And I am trying to build my page up. And unfortunately, it's slower than I want. But, you know, life happens. And I have to take care of my responsibilities. And I wouldn't have it any other way. Um, but you guys can help me by helping me by spreading the love and liking and following my Facebook page. And that goes for YouTubers as well. YouTubers, you can jump over to Facebook and go hit the like and follow button if you guys don't mind. Tomorrow Sunday. Tomorrow Sunday already. Doodles has to go back to work. <sighs> I look forward to the weekends when he's home. I know a lot of wives are like, oh, I can't wait for my husband to leave. But I truly enjoy being with my... Like when he says to me, oh, I'm going to go hang out with so-and-so. And I'm like, oh, really? Because I get disappointed. I love being with him. Even though I give him a hard time and all. Don't tell him, guys. I don't want him to think I'm getting soft in my old age. You know what I mean? All right. So, okay, look how it's coming, guys. Look how it's coming. Okay, we have another one to do. I probably should have done all these shapes all at once, but I didn't know if I would uh, need um, the whole napkin, you know, both napkins. Hey, Lila, or Lillian, I apologize. Hey, Lillian, how are you? Hey, Trina, I meant the largest pumpkin would obviously take the longest amount of time. To be oh, you're here for it. I got gotcha, you, girl. I got gotcha. you. Yes, that big one that I showed you earlier, I'm going to fabric. I'm going to, that one's going to go with um, 
some of my fabric that I bought. So hopefully I'll be able to do that this week. I mean, honestly, there's so many different things you can do. I mean, you can paint. I mean, seriously, you could do so much. I'm going to save that large piece. Let's use this piece. Um, trying to find a piece that will fit that. Let's go right there. Um, you can paint the pumpkins. There's a woman that does gourds, and they're beautiful. Beautiful. I love them. I love things that are a little different that you don't see everyone and their mother have, you know. Okay. Hey, Cindy Johnson on YouTube. How are you? Hey, Sandra, where did you get the napkins? Go or just, um, these came from one of my followers. Um, there was, we, we kind of like, um, when we get a new napkin, that's really fabulous. Um, we kind of like send them to each other. So there's a group of us that there was a group that, um, was started. I don't know if it's still going on. I don't think so. Um, where it was all about paper products and we would go in there and share and trade napkins and stuff like that, you know? And, um, oh wait, did this fold? Hold on. Yep. It sure did. So hold on, let me cut this. All right. Lay it back down. Better. You don't want that straight edge. So what I'm going to do, let this dry. And we're going to use it again. Get off. Get off. Oh, Mod Podge is so sticky. Get off. Okay. Thank you, Sandra. We're not done. We're going to bling it out. It's going to be... Fabulous when we're done. It's going to be fabulous. Do you guys watch, um, like, all my shows on Netflix are kind of, we've watched them all, and nothing, The Crown has not come out yet with anything new, um, maybe on a few, but do you guys watch Sweet Magnolia? It's so good. I just dropped some Maj Podge on my table. Um, I started watching it, uh, last year, and they just... I have some more episodes to watch, and I'm catching up on it. It's like a, a Lifetime movie or a Hallmark movie. It's really a sweet movie. If you want something lighthearted, good feelings, um, Sweet Magnolias on Netflix is a good one. All right, let's do another one. Uh, where did I get the, where'd the pumpkin from? Last year, Walmart. Last year, Walmart. Um, is Jeanette still on here? Jeanette is um, someone from my private group who um, works in Walmart. She's a manager in Walmart. I don't know if she's still on here. Maybe she can give us an idea when pumpkins and stuff like that are going to be coming to Walmart. I know it's different in all areas, but they kind of run around the same time period. Yeah, you're going to have to watch out for them. Whoopsie. 
Okay, this one has a little straight edge, so we're going to, there we go, fix that. All right. So yeah, so now I'm in the middle of watching Sweet Magnolia. I'm excited. I'm liking it. Because again, it's a lighthearted. You don't have to think about it. But Doodles and I are looking for our next series, what we want to watch. We don't know anything good. Do you guys have any suggestions? Um, when is the subscription group on? I'm going to be going in there this week, Heather. I meant to go in. But honestly, it's just, I've been nuts with my mom, you know, until she got out of the hospital. So I'm praying that she gets out um, on Monday. And this way I can go in there and we're going to have some fun in there. So the subscription group um, is, you see that little green heart down at the bottom in the by the comments? That is uh, my subscriber group. It's $4.99 a month. And... Um, I go in there, I do a live, a little demo of, it could be whatever, a craft, a wreath, you know. Um, I'm going to put some bow tutorials in there. Um, it's called Katie's Happy Hour. You guys know me. You know that I'm a an old bartender. Well, not old, but, you know, I did it for 25 years bartending. And uh, I retired. About 10 years ago, I retired and um, might even be a little bit more than that by now. And it's so funny. Last night we were watching a show, Doodles and I, and they were, the guy was drinking a Manhattan. He's like, what's in a Manhattan? And I was like, I had to think for a moment. I was like, what's in a Manhattan? And I was like, well, whiskey or rye, uh, vermouth, you know, and I was like, girl, still got it. I still got it. Once a bartender, always a bartender. Yeah, still got it. Um, that's how I would know my customers. I may not know their names, but I would know them by their drink. You know, so funny. <laughs> hey, Zila. Hey, Shona. How are you? They will have a new season coming. Ooh, who? Who's having a new season? The Crown? I know when. When I'm waiting for The Crown to come, and there's one other show. Oh, um, I call it River Phoenix, but I know that's not the name of it. River, River's Edge? No. River something river. Quiet River, Rainy River. Oh, Lord. Doodles is always correcting me. Something River. Oh, man, Shevitz. What is it? Okay, so you see I have some spots that are not covered. So I'm going to just take a few. And I'm just going to fill them in, okay? Just ripping them and covering them up. Okay. Virgin River, that's it. So I'm waiting on that one. Sweet Magnolia. Oh, Sweet Magnolias. Oh, awesome. I was a bartender in a private club for a few years. Oh, were you, Mom? Learned something new about Mom today. I didn't know that, girl. Oh, I need every napkin I can get. Don't fall. I need you. Please don't go. Don't go. I'm begging you to stay. Hey, hey. All right, a few filler spots, and we have one left. I think I might have another one of these napkins, but I'm not sure. I'd have to go look. Hopefully, I got more, because this was, I didn't have a whole package of this. 
So it was given to me. Mom, actually, I believe mom or teeny. I'm not sure who gave me this leopard one. I'm begging you to stay. Hey, hey. Don't go away. Oh, Cindy, I'm glad you're doing well. That's awesome to know. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. See, these edges, I don't like these edges. So I'm going to take a little water. I'm just going to come right over here. I'm going to just pick that out because I don't like those straight edges. Uh, once a flight attendant, always a flight attendant. I can do it. My sleep. Oh, really? Who did you um, fly for? Do you guys like Virgin River? Boy, that dried, that dried awfully fast. Did you see that? Okay. All right. So we're going to go in and fill in some of the spots. And I'm going to try not to waste too much of the napkin. I'm begging you to stay. Hey, hey. And don't go away. Even like these little tiny pieces right there. You're never even going to know. Never in a million years. Sometimes I use my tweezer because sometimes they're like really small and you need them. That's why I saved that piece before. I'm begging you to stay. Na, na. Don't go away. Oh, I have my fan on. So, hold on. It's like we're doing surgery here. Okay. Okay, got a piece down here. And I'm just ripping some of these apart just to cover a few pieces, a few areas. Okay, oh, we got one down here. It's sticking to my hand because I have Maj Podge on my hand. Okay. Don't fly away on me. I should turn my fan off. But I put it on so the paint would dry. And the Maj Podge would dry. All right, we got a few spots over here. Can you see them right here? We're going to fill them in as well. So this is where you have to be like kind of mindful of how you use your napkins when you're low on them. It's almost like a, a puzzle. You know, you got to start filling in.
Okay. Um, Laura, um, hopefully, fingers crossed, mom will be going off to rehab on Monday. So I'm excited about that. It looks like they've got her medication under control. And I keep saying that. I've said that about, I don't know, six or seven times tonight. And I hope I'm not jinxing it. <laughs> I pray that I'm not. But um, she's doing okay. okay. We are almost done with this bad boy. We're going to do the top. Okay. So I usually leave the top to last. Why? Because I don't know. Just what I do. Like right around where the um, stem goes. Please don't go. Don't go. Oh my goodness. The door prize just getting better. Oh my God. Jason, I'm going to have to call you. He's been working and working his little took us off. He has. And I'm so happy he's helping me out because it really means the world to me that, you know, I got to say all the coaches, um, they really have been such a support. And I mean, every day they ask me how my mom is. Is there anything I can do? Katie, go lay down, relax. You need time to, you know. And um, they've just been so good. And Katie, if you don't want to go live tonight, I'll cover you. You know, don't worry. They really have been. Um, I hope you guys can see the friendship that we have formed. All of us. I don't need this big of a piece. Because really, um, I hope it shines through because we really do have a great friendship. So I hope it shows. I know you hear, sometimes you'll hear us bicker at each other. And that's only love. And that's truth. That is just love. Um, like I would, you know, like um, bicker at a, my brother or sister. You know what I mean? And sometimes I feel like I may be closer to um, the coaches than um, my brother and sister. <laughs> you know? For real. All right. What are you guys thinking of this pumpkin? What are you thinking? I'm thinking it's freaking fabulous. Okay, and we're going to dress this bad boy up. I got a few more spots to fill in. I'm going to take a sip of water. Oh, thank you, Deborah. You go. Can't wait. It's like 84, 84 days away already? Lord. We flew to Georgia two weeks ago. It was my two-year-old granddaughter's first flight. She loved it. The flight attendant took made sure she had snack, juice. They made, Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Katie, those are absolutely gorgeous. Oh, thank you, Trina. Girl. Girl, you know it's true. Ooh, 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 I love you. Do I hear popcorn popping upstairs? What, do I, what am I hearing? Is tomorrow sun? Tomorrow is Sunday. I think I've asked that already. You know, my duos goes back to work. It makes me sad. Saturday nights make me sad. Back in the day, Saturday nights would be like, Listen, let's get ready and go out. Now Saturday nights are like, oh, Doodles goes back to work. That makes me sad. Okay, let's just see if I got my whole outside done before we go under. Okay, we got to go under a little bit here. Let me just see. Yes, yeah, so we got to go under right around here. So normally, I'm going to show you my other pumpkins. Um, normally... I would do the whole bottom, okay? But I don't think I have enough of this napkin. 
to do the whole oopsie I got Mod Podge on my hands I don't have enough of this pumpkin I mean enough of this napkin so we're gonna do as much as we can and then I think I'm gonna use this other brown pumpkin uh, napkin over here Girl, you know it's true. I don't know why I have Millie Vanilli in my head. Could someone answer me that, please? For the, for the Lord above. Are we going to get to 100 again? Huh? Is that possible? I, want, I have things I want to give away. Girl, you know it's true. Ooh, 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 I love you. Whoopsie. Don't rip. I just need you to slide off my finger. Oh, Lord. Here we go. Okay. Hold on. This is how I get Mod Podge all over my hands. Okay, what's happening here? Uh, my granddaughter calls it church day and tells me I can't clean the house. It's God's day. She's right. You can't. <laughs> I like the way your granddaughter thinks. I like the way she thinks. Okay, so we have like this much to do and I'll show you the bottom of my other one is all covered okay so I like to have it all covered matching and I don't think I have another napkin like this so we're gonna have to work our mojo um guys if anyone is going to crafters convention and you would like a ticket. I have an extra ticket. Unfortunately, I won't be able to go because of my mom and dad and their health issues. So if anyone is interested in getting a ticket, because I know they're sold out, um, I have one that can be transferred into your name. If you want to just text me at my text alert number, um, it's 845-299-8674, letting me know you're interested in it. And... Uh, we could chit chat okay but it is available Uh, Trina Cooper, we flew from Milwaukee to Georgia when I was landing in Georgia. She looked out the window and asked, what are we looking for? She said, Georgia. I'm uh, looking for Georgia. Oh, that's cute. What part of Georgia did you go to? I have two friends that live in Georgia, and I used to go all the time to Georgia, but I haven't been there in a while. Whoopsie. Mm. 
Now we're gonna take a quick look, guys. Ooh, we're moving back up. Moving back up. We're moving on up to the east side to a deluxe apartment in the sky. Oh, we're moving on up. Okay. We have that much. Oh, lordy. We have that much left to do. Oh, I missed a little area. Hmm. Let's see if I can get this in there. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. And it worked. All right. I just want to look real fast to see if I have another napkin of this type. We're moving on up. Let's just see. If not, I'll do something with those. Um, whoop. Tag. I didn't even know that tag was in there. Leopard, leopard, leopard. Where is leopard? It's not in there. Let's see. Is it in my pile here? Leopard. And Kenzie Childs, I love you. Love you. Oh, there's a snowflake in here. Look at these birds. This one is beautiful, this napkin. I think Teeny gave me that napkin. That's beautiful. I, I got Mod Podge on my finger. Moving on up to the side to a deal. Look at the dollar bills. Look at that one. Isn't that funny? I don't think I have another one. And that was the only one that I had. Okay. So we're going to have to adapt and excel. And that's what we're going to do. Okay, so we're going to take this pumpkin one. First, I'm going to get this Maj Paj off my hand. Okay, we're going to use this pop pumpkin. All right, and we're going to take a pumpkin. And let's get some tape. So we have to... Take off the back, and this one most likely is a three flyer. Um, you really you don't know if they're three flyers until you try, unless you have the actual uh, wrapping that it comes in, the cellophane. Usually it tells you on the outside if it's two ply, one ply, three ply. Most of the better napkins, though, are um, three ply, I'm noticing. Yeah, so this was a three ply one. So we're just going to make this my bottom. I'm going to cut out um, um, we're going to cut out a pumpkin and I'm going to put it on the bottom here. So let's get our little paintbrush. Okay. And let's Let's go this pumpkin right here. Let's get it wet. Okay. And let's do this one over here. Oops. All right. Let's see how we like that as our bottom. All right. I'm going to do this down here. Okay. And there's a little... There's a little label, the I guess whoever made the napkin. I want to pull that off. And the little feather. All right. So let's see how this 
for the look down here. I may not need it so big. We may, ooh, that's not bad. Okay, we don't need it so big. So I'm going to cut the stem. We're just going to go around that. Pull that off. Everything is sticking to my fingers because it's Maj Paj. Get off, get off, get off, get off. Okay. All right, so we're just going to, I can make it a little smaller. Because I don't want it coming up the top. I don't want you to be able to see it from the side of my pumpkin. just got a hole in it and that's okay I think that should be okay yep that should be okay so let's get oh do we have a hearts party I love a hearts party I love a hearts party I love a heart so I'm just gonna put some Mod Podge on here so since it's the bottom I'm gonna put it all on as one piece okay and someone was asking me about that before and I didn't want to do it towards the top because I don't want so many wrinkles. All right. But now since this is the bottom and we're going to have ribbon and um, sequence and stuff, bling, 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 all around there. Okay. It's going to look like a nice little surprise on the bottom. Now I just want to make sure that doesn't come up. Now that's going to come up just a little, so we're going to cut that. I love a heart party. I love a heart party. Oh, look at all the hearts. When my niece was four years old, it was Father's Day, and we were going to church. When we got there, she was holding her dad's hand. hands. Present, my sister asked why she brought it to church, and she said, I have to give it to Father. The Oh, because it was Father's Day. Got it. That's cute. All right. So let's get the Maj Paj going on here. Again, we don't want it too thick. Okay, because we don't we don't want the napkin ripping. But since it's on the bottom, it's okay. You're not gonna see it from the top of this pumpkin. Um and normally I'll put my um, business card on the bottom, but not on a, a decor item like this. Because if they put this in a dough bowl or on their, you know, island in their kitchen, you know. Because um, pumpkins like this, you can do so much with decorative pumpkins like this, guys. I mean, it's not just for an insert in your wreath, you know. Think decor in your home. All right. So we're going to let that dry. Okay. We're going to let that dry. And you're not going to see that from when I turn it upside down. Okay. You're not going to see that. I love a hot party. You know what I love about Maj Paj? That when you get it, take it off. Do you ever put Elmer's glue on your hands and then peel it off? That is the feeling you get with Maj Paj. when it's on your hands. I love the feeling of it. When I was a kid, I would take Elmer's glue and just paste my hand with it. You know, just like paint it on. Wait for it to dry. <laughs> I know. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy.
All right. I think we're done with the Maji Podgy Pudding Pie. Okay. Maji Pie, this is both funny and precious. I know, right? That's a cute story. A really cute story. All right. So that's on. We can put Maj Podgy away. We can throw that out. I'm going to get my bling. Throw that in the water. All right. So while this is drying for a couple minutes, let's pull out our bling. The fun part of the evening. Hey, Leanne. Oh, thank you for the hearts, Wanda. Leanne, Mom. I love a hearts party. I love a hearts party. All right. So recently, I've gotten some trim, okay? I got to peel this off my fingers or it's going to drive me crazy. Um, and I got some uh, bling, bling, bling. I get a lot of it from um, Rachel. Hey, girl. Um, I get a lot of it from Hoblobs, you know, when it goes on sale. But I just bought two packages of Totally Dazzled. <gasps> it's gorgeous. Gorgeous. But, and I also got bling. I think we're going to use the gold here in this one. Um, but let me show you what I got. I love a hot party. I love a hot party. You need some happy mail for me, girl. You do, gal. Okay, so let me show you this. I got this bling for the pumpkins that we're going to do during the week. The fabric pumpkins. Um, I got these three um for my fabric pumpkins okay oh my god you would think i'm getting into fort knox with all the um the wrapping on here okay the cellophane okay come on let's go let's get it off all right there we go we got it off okay so um to be honest this was a little pricey Okay, so I'm not suggesting everyone runs out and gets it, but it's gorgeous. Can you see it? Look at it. It's gorgeous. So we're going to put that on the fabric pumpkins. Okay, and then on this pumpkin tonight, um, I was thinking of using, I got these. Oh, my water. Lord, that was scary. Hey, Jeannie, I will one day get me some totally dazzled bling from here. You never know. I may give some away. You never know. I got this for one of my fabric pumpkins. Now, this is only, how much is this? Three yards. This is only three yards. So, we're going to use this, I think, tonight. Okay? But look at this. Now, I've never used this before, so you and I will be on a learning curve together. Okay, and it's awful sticky, but I'm going to try and pull it out. Okay, but I want you to look at it. Look at the bling. How great will that go tonight? Can you see that? Okay, and I got the same one hold on, in black for, I might have to buy more of this. For one of my fabric pumpkins that we're doing. I love a hot party. I love a... Unless I go to therapy to learn. Oh, I'm sorry, Gail. I'm sorry you're going through all that. So this is the black. Do you see it? It is stinking gorgeous. And we're going to use this in it. Not tonight's design, but we are going to use this in a design. One of my fabric pumpkins. So I just, I went on Amazon. I looked up trims. Now these two that I'm showing you right now are not as pricey as the silver. The silver was pricey. These two, if I remember correctly, were not as pricey. I want to say for three yards, it was like $15.99 each. Um... So not as bad. I believe this one for, I don't know how much is in this one. Um, let me see. Uh, 10 yards, four millimeter. 
Um, I think it was like $25 for that one. And I got to save the label. Oh, thank you, Jean. The black is gorgeous, right? Yes. But we're going to use this gold one tonight. We're going to use this gold one. And I have some really fabulous big bling 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 from Totally Dazzled that we're going to use as well. Um, hold on. Let me put Maji Paji and paint away. Maji Paji put and pie. Maji Paji put and pie. Oh, there's my wood glue. Wood glue, I was looking for you. Why were you hiding? Why were you hiding from Mama? Okay. Everyone, oh, oh, don't fall. Don't fall. Don't come back. Everyone must be sleeping upstairs. I don't hear Maisie. I don't hear Clancy. All right, so in this pile of fabulousness, I have gold. I have silver, but we're going to go gold. I believe we're going to go gold on this. Let me pull out my gold I have. That's silver. Oh, there's some gold in here. What is that? Anything with gold in it, we're going to take out. Because you know it's going to be. And I don't know if I have a lot of gold. I don't think I have a lot of gold. But whatever gold I do have, we're going to take out. And we're going to... Ooh, rose gold. That might look good. <gasps> we might do some rose gold. That might look good. Okay. We can always mix the mediums, too. Okay. All right. So we have that. Awesome. 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 Okay. So I need to get... Hold on one second. I gotta get black ribbon. Um, and my little go for a potty break. I'll be right back. I'm just going in here to my other room to grab um one inch ribbon. What is that? Three eighth inch. What is this? What size is this? What is this? Right. Well, that's adapted Excel. Adapted Excel. All right, all my Christmas wreath frames came in, and they're like blocking me from my ribbon bin. But I have this brown, which we can layer with that. Okay, so let me see how this is going to look. Let's move this over here. Let's clear a path here. Bling Bling is a uh, girl's best friend. All right, so this is what we're going to do. Let's see how this is. Okay, first, let's get it together, people. Get it together. Why are you coming apart? I'm going to have to re-roll you. All right, so I have this brown, um, like, glittery ribbon. It is um, 5 eighths inch. Okay. And let's see how that gold is going to look on there. Then we're going to take this gold. Oh, my God. It's going to look fabulous. Perfect. Look how this is going to look on there. That's perfect. Can you see that? Perfect. Okay. So let me dry this. Okay. You guys are on a potty break. We're taking a potty break. Let's get this back into all the glue over here. Oh, Bonnie, Gail, it's going to look fabulous. I'm going to be listing my sunflower pumpkin. If you guys are just getting on, this is my sunflower pumpkin that I did earlier. Um, and here is my other pumpkin that we did. We might add a little blink to that. I don't know. But we'll see. All right, we got to dry this bad boy up. Okay. And I'll list all my pumpkins. Maybe tomorrow while I'm at the hospital. I'll take pictures in the morning. And then this way I can list. 
going to be fabulous. These are really, I mean, honestly, they're easy to do, easy craft, great to, um, like I said, fill your shop. Um, of course, Gail, you can call me that girl. Um, great to fill your shop. Great for if you're going to a fair, a craft fair, to put on your tables. You can stack them, make them stackable, put them on a candlestick. I mean, there's so many singing things you can do. Oh, you know what? Is my glue my glue gun is on? It's gonna say I should turn my glue gun on. All right, we'll give it another minute and then we'll get blinging out. Give people to come back, spread the love, get a drink, go potty. Because I know I've been on for a while. So I appreciate all you guys hanging out with me because I had to make up for not going live for a while, you know. But life is crazy for me right now. Oh, it's drying really nicely. Um. And you can see, like, there's a little spot there, but we're going to cover that up with the bling. So you're not even going to see that. Okay. All right. I think we are good. Think we're good. All right, let's turn this bad boy off. All right, I love my heat gun. I, I say that all the time. I use it. I love you. I should have got you a while ago. Um, do you have to spray them with something at the? So I will, Gail. I will put uh, polycrylic over this. Okay. So if you do put it outside, it it stands up a little bit better. You know what I mean? All right. So let's get started, shall we? We're going to put the brown on first. Okay. And we're going to start up here and work our way down. So I want to see where is my... This is... What did I do with the cobber knobber? Oh, it's over here. Okay, that's the other one. That's for this one. So this one goes in here. So I just want to see how far down right about there. Okay, so that should be good. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Didn't mean to do that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, good. All right, so we're going to put, I'm just going to cut this, give a fresh cut, and we're going to put just a bit. You know what I should get out? before we get started just a little touch and i'm just going to put a touch of glue right there just to hold it and i'm going to get my little silicone makeup brush from the dollar tree so i will burn my phalanges okay all right let's move this Out of the way, let's make some some room here. Hold on. Move that out of the way. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. So we're gonna come down here to the back side. Make sure you pull it somewhat tight. 
Um, I need a little glue. And you don't need like globs of glue. Okay, you just need a little bit of glue to hold it. Okay. I'm going to press on it and then we're going to cut that bad boy right there. All right. So we have our first one on. Now we can do every row if we wanted. Um, every groove. Let me see. Okay, so that's the first one. Okay, let me see. How do we feel about every groove? I kind of like every groove. All right, we're going to go every groove with the brown. And what I'm going to do is just put a little touch of glue somewhere in the middle of my groove. Just to hold it. I'm missing comments. My water bottle is in the way. Where did you get the dryer? Amazon, Carol. Do you have to, um, their Mod Podge? Yeah, so there's Mod Podge over them, but I will polycrylic it as well. Okay? So when you Mod Podge something, it does protect it. But I like to give it just that a little extra something, something, you know? So I will go in and polycrylic. Um, the little sections. Okay, so I like that. Okay, so we're going to go around and do that. Okay, and we're just going to continue all the way down. And again, this section might be a little tedious. Babe, would you grab me a water while you're in the garage? Yeah, when I come back in, okay, I'm taking her out. Thank you. Okay. okay. And then we cut. Do you have to spray it with a seal it after you're done with all this so the paper doesn't come off? Well, like they said, the Mod Podge is on there. The paper is not going to come off. But, I mean, if this is in soaking rain, let's say, you know, you put it out in your driveway and it's pouring rain out, it's, I mean, ultimately it's a napkin, guys, you know, but I'd like to put on an extra piece. Um, what's happening here? Um, an extra piece just to hold it um, sealed. So if you do have it on your porch in a topiary or something, you know, um, It will be safer. You know, I would suggest that this is an indoor or in a covered porch area. That's what I would suggest. If someone is making these or purchasing them or whatever the case may be. Um, it will be put on my, um, in my Etsy shop as indoor use um, or you know, under a covered 
porch. On Amazon, is it listed as Hikan? Yes, Carol. And the brand is Wagner. I think it's a Wagner 500. And I absolutely love it. I can't tell you enough how much I love it. Love it. It's probably right now one of my favorite tools in my shop other than my doodle caddy. And you know my doodle caddy has got to be my favorite favorite. It's just got to be. So take your time when doing this because you want it to be neat. You don't want to rush. You want um, your pieces to be on there nice and taut like that. Okay. And don't forget, I have ribbon bundles in my Etsy shop. Um, I have summer beach ones. Um, I have patriotic. I have fall, fall, uh, this ribbon, actually both the uh, ribbon, listen to me, bundle, uh, napkin bundle, both these ribbons. Uh, listen, I'm not saying ribbon. I'm saying napkin. Katie, get it together, girl. Both those napkins are in a bundle in my Etsy. Um, we have Christmas in there. Um, what else we have in there? Um, I can't even remember. But I just added, because um, I got new napkins um, last week um, that I sent away for. So I put them while I'm at the hospital. Um, you know, I take pictures the morning of, and then I go to the hospital, see my mom. And then, um, you know, I'm sitting there while she's napping or whatever, going for a test or whatever. It's whatever's going on. And... Um, And I'm able to list some items. So even though I'm not working like I normally would be working, I'm still getting work done. All right. That's looking good, guys. We're not even done. Because we got, look at this bling, what it's going to look like on here. Just imagine what this is going to be like. Just sitting on top of that. Is that not going to be gorgeous? Oh, my God. I can't. I can't with the beautifulness of it all. So sometimes when you buy trims and stuff, you may not have a plan for it in that moment. But when there's a good price on something like this right here was a good price. And honestly, at the moment, I didn't know what I was going to use this trim on. But I've used it twice now on two pumpkins. And I love it. Oop, glue, glue, glue spiders. Will you have enough trim? Oh, yeah. This is, how many yards is this? This is 10 yards. So the gold, I don't know if I'll have enough. But if I don't, I can always order more. Or we can do every other one. Or we can adapt an Excel. There's so much we can do. You know? I'm not too worried. Honestly, when I come live, guys, and I'm designing, I don't really get too worried about, is this going to work out? Is that going to work out? Because, listen, we're all human. If it, if my craft or my wreath or whatever it is I'm designing doesn't work out, I won't be the first person in the world to ever have a craft not work out. You know what I mean? So I never really ever stress over it. Just like the bottom. I didn't have enough of the napkin on the bottom. We adapt and excel. You know? We just mm -hmm. adapt and excel. Mm -hmm. What, baby? Mm -hmm. um, oh, perfect. I'm so thirsty. What is that? Is that for me? Mm. What is it? Who is that? Ooh, did I get some did I get some happy mail from a follower? <laughs> I love happy mail. 
Doodles brings in the mail. And uh, I honestly don't even think about going to get mail. Hold on, I'm opening something, guys. I'm going to see what it is. It's from uh, uh, Belinda. I don't know who Belinda is. The name does not sound familiar. Hold on. I don't want to show the address. Let's see what it is. What is it? <gasps> oh, look, guys. Is there a note? There's no note or anything. Look at it. They sent me um, IOD uh, molds. Oh my God, look, you can do all the molds. <gasps> I just had a fabulous idea. Oh my God. I just had a fabulous Thank you, Belinda. I love that. It was so sweet. You guys rock. You guys are the best. I love my followers. You guys amaze me. Amaze me. Um, we have Mike, the Headless Chicken Festival this weekend, and my daughter just brought me a strawberry funnel cake. Oh, how nice. You're in heaven. Oh, thank you for going, coming into my life. I love watching you online. You always make me feel better. Gail, girl. Gail. I love you, girl. I love you. Uh, I think that might have been a little too much glue right there. You got carried away with loving on uh, Gail there. Okay, hold on. I don't want all that to spru spew out. Okay. You gotta pay attention. A little too much glue. A little too much glue. Hold it down. Okay. We're gonna get through it. It's not the end of the world. That was so nice of Belinda. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're on here or watching the replay, thank you. Yes, mold. Got to go as to work tomorrow. Pumpkin is pretty. Oh, Reba, I'll take pictures of it and I'll post it when it's all said and done, girl. Okay? But I told you guys, I kind of warned you. This was I was going to take my time and we were going to, it's going to be a long one, you know? This was going to be a long... I think I've lost... Is Teeny even on here? Usually Teeny hangs with me, but she's probably sleeping by now. But I appreciate you guys hanging out with me and hanging with me this long. I go live tomorrow on the Crafting Coaches Corner, but that will be much earlier, and it won't be this long of a, a live. Um... And I have a fun, fun uh, DIY to do tomorrow. So I'm actually looking forward to it. I've been wanting to do it for a while. Um, and finally, I'm going to do it tomorrow. So I'm excited for it. You guys, if you're looking for my Etsy shop, it is scrolling across the bottom. It's Crazy Maisy Creation, uh, Creations on Etsy. And if you're looking for my website, it is um, crazymaisycreation.com. And I just added some new signs into my website last night. And I was going to add more today, but I just never got the chance. Looking good. Looking good. People, are you bored? Am I losing people? It's okay. I understand. We've been on a while. And I get it. Oop, that's hot. Hot glue is hot, people. I do try to warn you about that.
Hey, Nancy, how are you? I love watching you. So fun and uplifting. Oh, thank you. Love seeing you on the longer, the better. Oh, Sandra Scarpato, I just love you, girl. I told my daughter how special of a person you are and how wonderful you are with your parents. Oh, thank you. Cindy's still with me. <laughs> oh, wait. I glued it already. We got to cut it. Right? We got to cut it. Listen, I try to be a good daughter. Do the best I can while still, you know, holding up to my responsibilities as, you know, a wife and everything else. Because, you know, you got to be all things, right? As most women know, right? You got to be all things. That was really nice of Belinda. I love getting happy mail. You know, as much as I give happy mail, I get happy mail in return. And it just makes me feel good, you know. The same way you guys love seeing happy mail in your mailbox, I love it as well. And it's fabulous people like you all that just on a day when, you know, things may not be going right or whatever, Something comes to me in the mail and it just makes you feel special, you know. Gary made me a card and wrote some beautiful things in there for me, which uplifted me. Um, I had it over here, but I think I moved it because I didn't want to crush it with all my, my florals I had there. Okay, we're almost to the end. Almost to the end. And there's Toboggan. Toboggan, what are you doing up so late? What time is it? Does anyone know the time? Actual, oh, it's a quarter of 11. Lordy day, I love it. I'm never up this late, like, crafting. It has been forever. Told you it was going to be a long one. Because I just wanted to take my time and... Hang out with you guys. I'm back, but Katie never knows. I left for a bit. <laughs> Connie! Connie, I did know. I asked for you before. Because I was asking you a question about why you were in Georgia. Did you go there on a trip or something? But you never answered me. And I said, oh, Connie left me again. Connie never stays with me. And I always know when she leaves me because I get alerts who comes on. And then, hmm, conveniently, I see my Connie girl is not with me. It's very funny. She knows I'm only teasing her. I love me some Connie McCormick. I do, I do, I do. Leanne's still with us. Aw, oh, thank you, girl. Thank you, Leanne. Okay. I went to Georgia with my daughter and her husband. Why? What's in Georgia? Why were they going to Georgia? A family trip or? Like, where in Georgia did you go? What town? Chilling in my recliner. Love watching your lives. I didn't take pictures of the patriotic turtle yet. Oh, Cindy, no worries, girl. Going to put him out tomorrow. Oh, my God. Take pictures and tag us. Tag Crazy Maisie Creations. I'm looking for another one. Becky wants me to make one for her father, and I can't find another one at home. My at, I've been to a few different at homes, and um, I mean not at homes, Home Goods, and um, they don't have them, and it's making me sad because I really want to make one for Becky. She's so sweet. I know you do, girl. I love it when you hang out and craft. It's relaxing to me. Oh, Lila. Thanks, girl. OK. 
Hi. Did Connie tell me why she went to Georgia? Where in Georgia did she go? I need to know all the information. You guys all know about my life. I need to know everything. Um, he has a house there. He who? And my husband helped him with some project. Alma, Georgia. I don't know where that is. He who? Your son-in-law has a house there? So you mean your daughter and son-in-law have a house there? Aren't they married? Wouldn't that make that both their house? Who has a house there? I'm confused. Katie, I will lock at mine, okay? I will lock at mine? What does that mean? I will lock at mine? Sandra Scarpato, what are you saying to me, girl? Am I missing something? So I'm hopefully going into my subscriber group. Hopefully, um... I'm thinking Tuesday, but I don't want to say Tuesday just in case I can't do it um, because of something with mom or something, you know, but I'm hoping Tuesday I'll go live in there. I think that will be the day. Um, as long as everything goes well, I will check for, oh, thank you, Cindy. That's very sweet of you. Um, um, so if you want to join Katie's. Happy hour. It's $4.99 a month. Just click that little heart down by the comments. It's Facebook finally gave me something, right? Finally. I mean, you hack, you let the, the criminals have my page, right? You let the hacksation stand and you took my stars and the, finally I got something. And Doodles and I have been talking about doing an auction to raise money for Alzheimer's. Um, you know, since my dad has Alzheimer's and now my mom has advanced dementia. Um, and you guys know I raised money in the past with my stars. Um, all the money went to Alzheimer's. Um, I want to do something again. So we're figuring out something to do. Because the devil went down to Georgia. She sure did. She sure did, Toboggan. All right. We only have two more of these to do, and then on to the bling, 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 bling. Bling, bling, bling. Toboggan, what's Michelle doing? she talking to Jacers? He's so excited that he got... All the work he did today. He did put a lot of work in. Hey, Donna on YouTube. How are you? How are you? How are you? Speaking of how are you, where's Trish Elliott? I haven't seen her. She means we will look for it. Oh, thank you, Sandra. Thank you, Leanne. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, son-in-law has a house there. His grandmother left him. Oh, nice. So that means it's your daughter's as well, right? So you guys just went for a couple of days just to relax. That's nice. All right, we have one more, and then it's bling, 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 bling. Okay, maybe when we do this one, we do the bling. We're going to first attempt every other one, just to make sure we have enough of that rhinestone, that glittery beautifulness, and... um. Then if I have enough, we can go see if I could do every one. Okay. Thank you, Bonnie. 
that might be a little too much glue that I just put there, but let's see. Let's press lightly. Ow, that's hot. So it doesn't squeeze out. That's the thing. You don't want it to squeeze out the sides. You want to try and keep it as neat and clean as possible. So that's why I always say a little bit of glue, not a lot of glue. Okay. Oopsie. So I'm sure Doodles is going to bed. And I'm going to have to clean my own paintbrushes tonight. Or I could always just leave them in the water till tomorrow. <laughs> Which I might do. <laughs> oh, if you saw this house, it's not a treasure. Oh, really? Well, listen. Anything can be fixed up. You know what I'm saying? All right. So we got our brown on. Got our brown on. I got fresh water doodles got me. Let's get a pin in that. All right. Let me take a sip. Perfect. Ooh, that's nice and refreshing. All right. So you see all the little spots. Well, there weren't many, but ooh, blue spider that I had are now covered. Okay. You can't see any of them. Blue spider. Okay. Looks really good. Bottom. Really good. I'm going to put some felt on the bottom. I'm going to cut out a circle and we're going to cover all that. Okay. So you won't even see that. All right. Let's get this on. So on the back of this, I noticed that there's some kind of stickiness that we have to take off, but I still want to add some glue. Okay. Just to be safe. Oh, thank you, Julian. I, Julian, I'm sorry. I thought there was an A there. There's not. Okay, so we're going to go every other one. Now, again, I've never used this, so we're just going to adapt and excel. So we're going to start here. No rhyme, no reason. That might be a little too much glue. Hey, hold on. I'm going to try and spread that out a, a little bit because that might be a little too much glue right there in the beginning. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take this off and put that right there and we're just gonna hold it i'm gonna take this skewer actually and just press it down okay and i'm going to just peel it off and every so often i'm going to just put a little touch of glue on that ribbon okay You see what I'm doing? Peeling it. And keep it straight. You want to keep it centered in that ribbon right there. I'm going to put a little touch of glue right there. Holding it down. And I'm just going to cut. I've never cut this before, so let's see how this cuts. Ooh, pretty good. I'm going to hold it down. And what do you think? That looks good. I don't know if it's showing as good as it looks on camera, but that looks good. Okay. Let me see some hearts if you like it. If you like it, you love it. I want more of it. Okay, so we're going to do every other one just to make sure I have enough. Okay. I try so hard and I can't rise above it. Hot party. I love a hot party. I love a hot party. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, Marianne. Thank you, Tracy. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you, Mary Lou. Thank you. Thank you. I love a hot party. Oop, that's a little thick. Let's try and thin that out a little. Sometimes I just have a heavy hand. You know what I mean? Uh, 
I love a hot party. I love a hot party. Okay, hold on. I love a hot party. I love a hot. Thank you, Jeanie. Jean. Janine. No, Jean. 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 Thank you, girl. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, every other one. We're going to do every other one. I love a hot party. I love a hot party. Okay. Thank you, Donna. Thank you. Donna Brown, you left YouTube and came over to Facebook. Thank you guys. This, I love crafting. I really, really, I love it. It's my jam. I wish I had more time to craft, but I'm going to. Like, I will get it back. I, my life, I will get back. <laughs> I will. But for now, I take care of mom and dad as best as I can. Stay centered. Need another stick of glue. I love a hot party. I love a. All right, there we go. Got the glue stick on. I'm gonna cut this. Okay. It's looking good, guys. It's looking good. Yep, I did like Facebook better. Awesome. I can't get comments on YouTube. Why can't you get comments on YouTube? I'm good. My sister and I just finished making some patriotic table decorations for lunch room at Mom's Nurse. Aw, that is so sweet, Donna. That is so sweet. Doesn't it? Isn't it a good feeling to give back to the people that take care of your loved one? I enjoy it tremendously. I really do. She knows where the party's at. Yep. I'm so glad. Oh, thank you, Jillian. I, I do my best to take care of mom and dad. But I do miss my time here in the clubhouse. I gotta, I've got to be honest. I do miss it. I'm trying to keep it in the center so you guys can see. But I forget sometimes that I'm live and I'm not just crafting alone in my 
in my uh, at my table. Where'd you get the bling in the gray bag from? What is the name? It's Totally Dazzled. You can go to totallydazzled.com. Uh, I don't have an affiliate with them. Nothing. Um, I just like their stuff. I mean, I guess I guess I could get an affiliate, but I don't have one. So just go to totallydazzled.com. Here, I'll show you the bag again, and you can screenshot it. I love when uh, designers do that so I can... It'll be in my photo. See the website right there? Totallydazzled.com. Okay? Tell them Katie sent you. <laughs> they won't know who I am. <laughs> They'll be like, Katie who? Katie from New York. That loud mouth? No, we don't know her. No, no, no. We don't know her. Uh... Like after someone has a wedding, they should give the flowers to a nursing home after. Yes, Gail, I agree with you. Donate them. Absolutely. Donate them. Even like after funerals. I like I, I know it looks pretty and everything when you're, you know, you're going to a wake or whatever. But like after the burial, all those flowers. I remember being a kid and we'd run around the cemetery um, taking flowers. I would take flowers off to bring to my grandmother's. You know what I mean? Um, I think they should donate them. They'd be better served, you know, because after the burial, everyone leaves and, you know, they're just there. I think they, I think, um, loved ones at a nursing home would appreciate them more. Got a blue, a glue, oh, got it. I was like, in my head, I'm thinking, I'm going to need a tweezers for that glue spider. Gosh, I hope we have enough of this. I gotta say the sick sticky stuff on the back of this bling 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 is actually pretty strong. It's actually pretty strong. I'm not mad at it at all. Hey Olga, how are you? We give them the planted pots also to the nursing home in Colorado. Oh really? That's awesome. There's um a gentleman who every morning goes out and feeds the birds. So he goes out the front door. Now I see him, you know, if I go see my dad in the morning, I'll see him. He goes out with a nurse or an aide. And um and usually he's in his pajamas. He's a very cute man. And um he has a handful of Cheerios or cornflakes, something along those lines. And someone donated a bird bath that they put on the property for him. That was so sweet. And um, there's, from my understanding, a few birds that come to visit. Oh, a little glue spider. I'll take my heat gun and I'll go around and melt the glue spiders that are here. Um, and it's so sweet. I mean, he goes out religiously every day to feed these birds. And I just think that yes, they're older and yes, they may have dementia or Alzheimer's or whatever it is they have, but they're still people. They're human beings that did something for this country, whether it's 
They were school teachers, police officers, firemen, whatever, construction workers, garbage men, whatever their their thing was. In this country, we have a bad look on older people, you know, and honestly, I don't like it, you know, and it's a shame, especially people in nursing homes. Now, both my parents are retired school teachers. And just because my father has Alzheimer's or my mother has dementia does not make them any less than another person that is living still in their house and able to do whatever they do at the same age as my parents. They deserve to, you know, feed birds or whatever their their thing is, you know, and I'm so thankful. And that's why I love where my dad is because they are so good and they have so many activities and they don't talk down to the residents at all. And I just, I just love them there. You know, um, it's a great facility. I love feeding birds. When we went to Nashville, we went to a pond in the park twice to feed the ducks. Oh, Heather, that's nice. Now I've never sat and fed birds. I mean, I guess I would if, like, my parents wanted to go feed the birds or do something. Like, my father, when I was younger, um, he loved flowers and plants and everything. You know, and it made my mom happy. Oh, we only have two more to do. I think we're going to have enough, people. Um, and uh, so I would do something like that. Maybe a little garden or something, you know. And I'm sure that the nurse home... You know, if they had space or had a, a place for it, a little vegetable garden or something, or flower garden, we could do it. But my father is right now where he is in his uh, stage of Alzheimer's. He really wants to, ooh, don't rip that, um, really wants to be like left alone a lot of times. He, um, they kind of close off at some stage, you know, where... Um, you know, it's just ho so hard for them to remember and frustrating that sometimes they just want to stop. And that's kind of where my father is. So like when we go visit him, he'll say, um, okay, I've had enough and I'll be there like 10 minutes. You could go now, you know, because I think it just takes too much effort for him to think, you know, or if I talk to him, he has to answer or something like that. I try never to have him have to think really hard for an answer, you know, or ask them like too many kind of questions. Oops. There we go. Okay, one more. One more. One more. Um, me neither. They took care of us, and when they need, we should be there for them. That's how I feel, Cindy. Absolutely. Yes, the whole thing is we are all going to be in the... Absolutely, Sandy. You got that right. And listen, in my case, I have no children, you know, so I don't have children that are going to take me into their home or care for me. I mean, when it's my time, it's my time, you know, and I kind of, and I just hope that wherever I am, you know, that I'm placed in a, a, a very nice place. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, one as nice as my dad's, you know, and unfortunately it's, you know, I never was fortunate enough to have children. It, that was God's plan, I guess, you know, and it is what it is, but I got very lucky in getting the husband I have very fortunate and the parents that I have. So, um, I'm very lucky. Oops. I'm very, very lucky. Very blessed. And, um, we do have a little bit of this garland left, but not enough to do the other strips. So, I think it worked out really great. All right, there we have it. Okay, we're not done yet. 
I know you guys are like, are we done yet? It's almost like that car ride from hell. You know, are we there yet? <laughs> no, we're not done. So this was three yards and I have maybe a yard left. No, less than that. I have uh, 26 and a half inches left of this. So we used a little less than three yards of bling. So I have, thank you, Cindy. So I have about $15 of bling in here, maybe about $12, $11 of bling in here, just in the bling alone, you know, but that's okay. And we're going to bling it up even more. Yes, Lila, I do. I have two, a brother and a sister. All right. So we're going to put that in its case and I'm going to order more of this bling because I am going to use it for pumpkin season because these are going in my shop. And, you know, I got to be honest with you. This almost looks like leather on here. It almost looks like leather. It's so good. All right. Um, we have this. And what I'm going to do with this is we're going to gold it up. We got to gold it up, right? I didn't take my um, rubbing buff down here. So what we're going to do is, hold please, let me find, oh, here. We're going to take my Deco Art Matte Metallic Gold, okay, paint. And we're going to, we're going to bling, bling, bling. Oh, God, I can't open it. I got to, I got to um, shake it first. Thank you, Kelly. Connie McCormick, you're still here. Unbelievable. I'm just going to shake this. Now, I have this also in, um, and I'm just thinking now, in graphite. No, we're going to do gold. I don't want to do graphite. It's too gray. I don't want to do it. Okay. And I'm just shaking this up. Okay. And we're going to, whoopsie, we'll take the paint from the top, from the cap. And I'm going to hold the stem right here. And I'm going to grab, let's grab this brush. Just any brush will do you. And I'm just going to, I'm not covering it completely. Okay. I want to kind of, kind of hit the, the highlight spots of the stem. I still want some of that. Uh, brownish, bronzish. It's kind of like a bronze to come out of the stem. So normally I craft all day. I'd be on the phone, you know, fill orders in my shop. And thankfully we're still getting orders. Um, even though I haven't been really working my business at, like I should be, but again, life is what it is priorities, which are my parents right at this moment, um, especially my mom. Um, but um, normally I would be crafting, working all day long down here, chit-chatting with Teeny and Melissa and Michelle and all my friends. And I miss that. I miss my daily routine of my mom coming down, me doing a live, you know, her turning on QVC in the middle of my live. I'm missing that, like when it was happening, I was like, oh my God, mom, go upstairs kind of thing. But I would give anything right now just to have her come back to the house. And I keep praying every day that she will be back to this house because I know she will. I just know it in my heart. Okay. All right. We're going to heat gun this real fast. Hold on that in the water let's close that up what did jacers do where's jace tonight uh he was here i don't know where he is now he might still be working on um sponsors helping me out he really has been great um, or he may be in bed. Knowing Jace, he might be in bed. All right, we're gonna we're going to dry this up real fast. Get the pumpkin out of the way. I'm just holding it with my tweet, my uh, needle nose.
Now let's say, hopefully it's dry. It doesn't usually take that many, that much more. Um, you're a great man and a hard worker. Oh, he's up. Jay says you're up. I know you're doing fabulous. All right. We're going to put some glue up in here. Okay. Down in there, I should say. Okay. I'm going to stand up for the glue part. Okay. We might have to repaint this. Um, it's not completely dry, but that's okay. We can paint it after we get it on. Okay, let's stick it right back in. Hold on, let's touch that up. Hold on, I need a paintbrush. I need a paintbrush. Where's the paintbrush? That's not it. Is this it? This is it. Okay, hold on. Let's open this gold. I kind of smudged it a little. I will have this um, pumpkin in my shop my Etsy shop. I'll take pictures of it in the morning before I go to the hospital and um, then get it in my shop. If someone is interested in any of the pumpkins, I have this one still available and I have this one. Just text me at the number scrolling at the bottom. 845-299-8674 and we'll hook up. We'll chit chat. Um, if you guys want to know live alerts, when I go live, get on my VIP texting system at 845-299-8674. Text me the word crazy, K-R-A-Z-Y. Okay. And that will, t I'll get you on the VIP list and you'll know when I go live here on my page. If you want to know when I go live, like tomorrow I go live in the Crafting Coaches Corner, text me the word coach. And I send out a text when I go live. In the crafting coaches corner. Okay. That lavender. Did you guys see that lavender um, wreath I made the other day? It sold on my live. Someone texted me on my text alert system and said, how much is that lavender you just made on the live? I gave them the price and they were like sold. And they got the little one for free. Isn't that awesome? So it's another way of be you know beating everyone to the punch is being a part of my texting system. You know, and you'll know when um, I got things going on. Like you'll get all the information um, about sales, like in Maisie's Charming Treasures, the jewelry lot, the jewelry that I do. Um, when I have a meet and greet going on here in the Northeast which I'm going to be doing soon. We're going to do a meet and greet somewhere in the New Jersey, New York, Connecticut area. So I will send out information via my text alert system. So you definitely want to be on that. I don't send out too many texts. I send out birthday texts if it's your birthday. Okay. Guys, I think are, oh wait, we're not done. We're not done. Hold on. I got a glue spider, but I want you to put, tell me what you think. Hold on. Hold on. I want to put some bling, bling, bling. So I have some gold, but it has to be the right shade of gold. Not just any gold. Um... Does the heat gun work better than the hair dryer? Yes. Heather, I like the heat gun a lot better. Okay, so we have... Now, I don't know. Let's kind of look at it. We're going to look at a few things. Okay, we're not going to make our decisions right away. Oh, you're welcome, Jean. Jean, how are you doing, girl? Did I ask you? Did I miss your answer? Oh, look at that. That's pretty. Hey, Cal McHugh. How are you, friend? Teeny's pulling, I mean, Katie's pulling a teeny. How am I pulling a teeny? Either going um, live 
all night. Oh my God, look at those pearls. Um, or is it, let's try a rose gold. Let's see how a rose gold looks. I'm not liking this one. This one I'm not caring for. Put that back. Oh, hang up live and hang in in there. I know I've been a long live. I know I haven't gone live in forever. So I wanted to do, you know, I want to do, ooh, that's pretty. Hold on, let's see this one. So far I'm liking that one the best. Let me see what else. That's not the right shade of gold. Let me just check my bag of tricks. Um, Belinda, I got to send Belinda a thank you. That was really sweet. Hold on, let me check my bag of tricks. Of all the bling, bling, bling. Silver, silver. Oh, wait, what's this one? I love that cross. That's... My last cross. I used one already. No, that doesn't go. What do you guys think about the pendant? If I had more of that, like this one is that shade of gold. Oh, wait, there's another one in here. Hold on. Hold, hold, hold. Oh, this one might be a good one. No grapes. No grapes. No grapes. Hold on. Tell me your thoughts. Be honest. Do I have another? Yeah, no grapes. I had one more, I thought. Hold on. But I saw one in a bag. Rose gold, rose gold. Is this yellow gold? I don't think that's the same yellow. Yeah, I like the grapes too. Oh, you like the grapes? Hold on, let's see. Let's look at the grapes one more time. I'm so glad I caught your laugh. Oh, Sandy, thank you, girl. That makes me feel happy. I think it's too much. I think it's, I think they're too, they're not what I'm looking for. I need, it's not exactly how, what I'm looking for. The first one, I do love the first one, but I feel like if I put it in, I don't know if it could hold its own standing alone. I feel like it needs something else, like smaller. And I don't have a small, small one. Let me look in my bags of tricks. These are all silver. Oh, oh wait. Hold well, on, I got a small one. Or this one might be silver. Chase says, get off. That's what I love about Chase. Are you telling me get off or take that off? I don't like it. All right. There goes that. Bling, 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 bling. Bling, bling. Bling, bling. No. All right. I don't like it. I agree. I think we've done plenty to this bad girl. We'll have to save it for another design. All right. So that was fun, guys. Did you enjoy the pumpkin? So remember, if you're looking for these, these will be in my shop. Or if you want them, text me at the number scrolling at the bottom. Check out my napkin bundles that I got going on in my shop um what else don't forget about the subscriber button 
to join Katie's happy hour. Um, it is $4.99. Just click that green heart. And I will flip the camera around. And I will hold it up for you. All right, hold on. I just, I don't want to lose my bling. I lost it one time, you know, and it took me forever to find it. So let's just get all my bags of goodies back in the big gray sack like Santa. Ooh, I'm tired. All right. I am. It just hit me when I stood like this. Girl, you're tired, girl. You're tired. All right, um, let's flip that around. We're going to flip the camera around. All right, and I'm going to show you. Hi, guys. I'm going to show you um, the pumpkin. So what do you think? There's the stem. The only thing I'm going to do is put um, felt on the bottom to cover that, okay? So I will take pictures of this in the morning. I will get it in my Etsy shop. Um, this I will add into my shop. This one has bumblebees and sunflowers. It's really cute. Really cute. And then this is the other the other leopard that I did. Okay. And then hopefully next week we could do. I'm waiting on my tax um, to come. And I don't know. They were on back order. So I don't know when they'll get here. If they'll get here. Because we all know how shipping is. Um, so I just pray that, um, they do come this week. If not, I'll just figure out something else to do. Well, no, we'll do that, but I'll figure out another way of, instead of using like upholstery tax or they weren't upholstery tax. They were, um, they were tax that had like crystals and rhinestones on them. They were a little more decorative, decorative tax, I should say. Um, if they don't come in, I'll figure something else out, but I want to thank you guys for hanging out with me tonight. Was fun. Um, I will see you all tomorrow. If you have not joined the crafting coaches corner, please go over there. Like our page. Um, we have a great time over there. there. We're, we're just, we just have a good time. Every there's a live on there every day. All the coaches go live throughout the week. My day is tomorrow. Jace is on Monday. Um, from a touch to core, we have Michelle and Stoney from Wilds Creek and company on Tuesday. Then we have our marathon. If you've never seen our marathon, I think I do bingo this week. Um, it's uh, fabulous. Wednesday marathon is fabulous. Then we have Thursday. We have Rachel from Lovey's Flowers. Friday is our feature spotlight designer, which I believe is Robin Cragen this week um, from Cragen's Creations. Saturday's Teeny from Coastal Style, etc. And then me again on Sunday. So that's the lineup. Um, yes, it's a great mini marathon. Absolutely. This is a great marathon. Thank you. Good night. Good night, Cindy. Thank you, girl. Thank you, guys. I want to thank you for hanging out with me tonight. It's been fun. Sorry I can't get in here a lot more than I would like to, but it is what it is. So I'm glad I was able to get on tonight, hang out with you guys for a while. How long have I been on? Three and a half hours. Girls got to get some sleep. Girl, I'm tired. All right, guys. Have a great night. Thanks for kicking it with Katie, and I'll see you all tomorrow on the Crafting Coaches Corner Facebook page. Good night, YouTube. Good night, Facebook. Have a great night. Bye.